You all have your paper and pencils. Well, let me get a fucking book, I guess. <laughs> like, no. Primo's here! Do you want oh. me to add to my paper? Oh. No, no you, well, you can write stuff down that's not already said, but... Okay. Yeah, can I sit in and half listen yeah. while I catch up on school notes? Uh, sure. Good Better thing I nothing. good thing I have a uh, chicken with me, so. Will there be visuals, or is it just yes your sultry voice? No, it's it's visuals. I have a few examples, but. Okay, fantastic. And then we have a scrim at nine. Okay. So. Can my pen not fucking. There, work? I got a bug. There you go. We have a, we have a scrim at nine, and then we're gonna look over some of the different things from the scrim. After, so that's what the four hours is going to be comprised of. Yes, sir. Alrighty. So how do we want to do this? Um, I can't really stream, so I guess I just send this to everyone. Let's get the recording. Yep. <laughs> yeah, but you guys need to see the stuff. I mean, we could all go into like a group chat, and then you can screen share. True. The quality is going to be like absolute awful though. Like it's going to be so bad. Uh, it's fine. Okay. Here, I'll there just. Done? Yeah, I'll just put this in general chat for everyone. Hold on. Bam. Boot camp. You actually oh. did it. Don't, don't, don't look beyond what, what we're doing. Or slash just like, boot things. It's actually kind of nice. I am here. I am here. All right. So, is everyone open the thing? Yep. No. Yep. Yep. How many pages of notes do you estimate I will have taken by the end of the night? N like, not not a full page. Yeah. Okay, so I'm not gonna start a new notebook. This, One second. No, you don't. You don't, stuff, you don't need to sure. go like like buy a you know 500 stack of paper. And... Well, no, I have new notebooks, so I'll just go get a new. Get a, a fountain pen and an oil drum worth of. Fountain <laughs> ink, <you know? laughs> but yeah, okay. Give me like 10 seconds. I had like. Not even half of the page complete when I put down my notes. Stay right there. Alright. Uh, also, do you guys have sticky notes? I do have- I have a shit ton of sticky notes. Alright. If you I guys don't, don't have sticky I, notes, grab some. I can do some MacGyver shit and just- Yeah, let's we'll just tape, tape it, tape them. Hey, <laughs> exactly! <laughs> That's what I'm gonna do. Fucking inspect the gadget over here. <laughs> Alright. Is Kuzo back? Yeah, I mean, I was. I have a wireless headset, so. Oh, okay. Damn! Shut up, Sunrise. <laughs> John, shut the fuck up! Alright, I'm inside the little dock. I'm gonna just do right. my mic. So, how to learn Overwatch, alright? Is everyone ready for, to learn the video game? <laughs> yeah, right. the teacher. St step one for forget everything you know. Yeah, Sharp's just here for the ride. Smile. Um. Forget everything you know, okay? Overwatch is not about heroes. It's about resources and resource management. Everything you everything you have, everything you do is a resource, right? Abilities, alt, attention, time, space, pressure, all of these are different different forms of resources that your team has. So the most efficient team in a team fight wins the team fight. That's it, it it's not picks, it's resource trading and how efficient you are as a team. Alrighty. Um, given this knowledge, what do heroes like Tracer and Doom have in common? Don't read the things yet. Don't all answer at once. Why don't you just change like the font color to white and then change it back? Oh, can I actually do that? Yeah. Oh yeah, because you guys are all looking at my version. Or view only. Did that change the... We can't did, did that change okay. forever? I'll, I'll highlight it. So I can't read it. There you go. Yeah, you changed. Okay, yeah, so now, okay, yeah, so I can change this all live. Okay, cool. Yeah, yeah. Uh, they both evolved from Winston's. They both have mobility? They both have mobility? Yeah. Oh, what would that fall under? Uh... Which resource? I guess... Okay. Abilities. All right. Attention. E. Good job, Primo. Time and space, I guess. Mm, that's one thing their abilities might do is create space or consume time, but.
Let's try it. Okay. Oh, that does work, actually. Nice. Wait, is this, the same, boot? Is this the same boot camp as, as Sharp? The first page is the same, yeah. Oh, okay. I cheated and I already saw that. Yeah, that's fine, I know. Like, Loco's already read this, too. Um, yeah. So he should've know that. What the fuck, Loco? But I'm not saying anything. I'm just waiting for Loco. He wants everyone else no, to figure it's... it out. I, I want everyone except for Sharp Dancer. Cool. Because Sharp already knows this stuff. Okay. okay. Alright, yeah, so Tracer takes a lot of attention, right? Tracer's main resource that she consumes from the enemy team is attention, right? Doom, in, in a very similar way, consumes abilities from the enemy team, right? That's the main resource he, can, he consumes, right? But both so of them consume time, right? Both of them consume time and attention. But Tracer puts a lot more... They both put a lot of pressure on the enemy team. Tracer takes more attention and Doom takes more abilities. So those are slight differences to how they operate. Because like Doom fist goes in and then goes out really fast. Yeah. And to stop him you need abilities, right? Tracer goes in and stays in for as long as she can. Right? So the more attention you give to the Tracer, the can less time she can stay in and the more resources she has to use herself. Right? So they're they're there aren't really counters in this game. It's some heroes' resources are much more efficiently used on some heroes than others, right? So, like, it's not that McCree or Widow is a counter to Farah. It's that McCree's kit and Widow's kit is very effective against Farah's. It's not that they're just direct counters or anything. It's 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 the efficiency that their kit is used against their team, against that hero. It puts a lot of pressure into them. Yep. All right, you guys can read it. <coughs> what do heroes like here? What do heroes like Winston and Ryan have in common? Uh, make space. All right. How uh, how do they do that? By positioning. Ryan, I think Ryan is positioned. Okay. He positions to create space, but Winston, he has to to engage to create space. Okay, but what resources does he use to create space? Winston uses all his cooldowns, and Ryan is mostly his shield and in space. So, yeah, Ryan Ryan uses his shield. The what? Ryan uses his shield to create to take space, right? He he yep. uses his abilities. His fire strike is as a like a. a ugh, fuck! I can't even talk right now. The fire strike is a, a ranged ability, right? These are it's it's used to. To generate threat and like hold attention, right? Winston, in a very similar way, uses his abilities to take space, right? But they do it in different ways, and they do it with different um, efficiencies, right? So, like, if the space that you're trying to take is on the high ground, right? Ryan's resources aren't very effective against taking space on high ground, right? Winston is. Winston's resources are are completely based around taking high ground. It's not that, oh, Ryan has a big shield and can hold W through the choke faster. It's it's that Ryan's resources are much better at taking space on the same altitude as he is. And Winston's resources are much better used taking space that is on a different altitude than he is, right? Either lower or higher. Winston and Ryan aren't designated as tanks because they're hitboxes and health pools, right? It's it's because of how their resources are used on the enemy team, right? It, they they are the most efficient characters of taking uh, to take space in the enemy team. It's not the characters' names; it's the way their abilities are used and resources are used that designate their role. <sighs> All right, why is double shield the meta? Right, so thinking about these, right, thinking thinking about how characters aren't just their abilities that they have, it's it's the, the resources that they they can bring to the team, right? Why is double shield the meta? Again, Sharp. Or... Sharp. What do you want? Can you connect to PTR? Uh sure. Is there a new PTR patch? I saw one. No, um, I can't connect to it, so I'm trying to see if it's my internet or something. Because I have a PTR scrim, and it's not letting me in. Uh, yeah, I can try and connect to it. 
So I'm trying to test if it's the internet. If you can't connect either, I have to restart the internet, by the way. And you'll have to get over it. It's okay. I've already been through this stuff with Ruby, so... What are you running through, Ruby? Just the basics, like, first page. Gotcha. I didn't really change the first page at all. You guys having fun? Yeah, dude, it's great. They're all they're all answering at the same time. It's there's so many so many different answers. Uh, <laughs> so the they're time. sitting there completely silent, and the second yeah. we walk away, they're gonna blow up and talk. <laughs> all right, cool. Hey, yo, guys, I'll I'll be right back. Smile, wink. You can talk now. <laughs> <laughs> it's your turn. All right, now. guys. My so... hands are like cramping. I'm like writing everything. Nine so, you don't you have to write everything. Yeah, you, no, don't have to write no, you don't have to write everything. No, I do. Write. Stop, I do. <laughs> Kuzo, the girl in class, to don't, make colored notes. Kuzo, and don't stop, write stop I am! Class. Don't believe me, don't believe me. <laughs> Kuzo, don't write everything. Sharp, did you paraphrase it. Uh, I am paraphrasing, but I'm writing everything that you're saying. Okay. I'm paraphrased. Okay, but that's not great. Because then you're not paying attention to what I'm saying. You're just paying attention to the specific words I say. It doesn't even matter the order. So you're not paying attention to the content, you're just paying attention to the syntax. Yeah, Kuzo, get roasted. Okay, no, I guess I'm not roasting you, I, I'm just saying it would be- it, you would learn more from this. And also, it wouldn't hurt your hand as much. Oh, man. Uh, double shield is the meta because... Uh, all of the heroes are, that are used have the best resources... for... Taking and holding space, and working with shields. I think it's because like they like, are super. It's mostly because that was, they that are was close. That, yeah, you, you're on the right track. You're almost there. I think it's because it's like they are yeah. super efficient at taking and holding space, and it needs a lot of resources to do it. Yeah, like Orisa, for example, like it's probably the hardest tank in the game by far to like pull out of a position, like cause she has fortify and like a. A pretty like powerful shield that she can just hold space extremely well, and not give anything up. She's also still good at taking space too, so she's better at running at taking space, and so is Sigma because he has a forward moving shield that that can be placed at like any given time. Yeah, that's 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 why the tanks are yeah. Um, like the meta is not decided by what deals the most damage or what has the most health. It's it's decided by the most efficient comp with their resources, right? Like you were just saying, Arissa and Sigma are the tanks in this meta. They're the best tanks and the most efficient. They they have the best efficiency with the resources, right? For taking space and holding space. Like you're saying, Fortify is so good because it, it's it's only one cooldown, and it's not it's not an ultimate either. And it it almost forces ults out of the enemy team to get you out of that position, right? So it's what you're trading one cooldown for a lot more resources. That's what makes abilities good, right? That's that's really the difference between ultimates and just standard abilities, right? Other than like their cooldowns being a lot longer. It's that they the ultimates force more resources out of the enemy team on average than abilities do. There's obviously different some there's outliers, right? Where Fortify might as well be an ult, and Visor might as well be an ability, <laughs> because yeah. Visor doesn't Visor doesn't use many resources in the new team, right? It's usually just Hi. cover, cover and a shield, and or a shield, not even both. But like Fortify can take ults to get the Arisa out of the fucking off the fucking high ground, right? And so even that's why then she can survive. Yeah, even then, right? She still survives. So that's why Arissa and Sigma have the best and most efficient kit for taking and holding space, right? Can you guys finish my thought there on the other two roles? If you haven't read them already? That's, those aren't the whole answers, by the way. Those are just bullet points. So. Again, I'm still looking like, for more than I wrote is, here. Because like the shields are so efficient at holding and creating space, you kind of have to bypass the shield to actually get value. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Doomfist literally just. <laughs> Zoom and Reaper have the most efficient Reaper. against two shields, right? The, their kits are the most efficient against the double shield tanks and and these shields themselves, right? That's why Widow isn't good. Widow as a hero alone is is broken and overpowered, right? But in in this meta, her kit is so bad against shields. Her resources are are so are all basically wasted against 
shields. That's why she's not good. Even though she should be nerfed as a character. This meta just isn't good for her. What do you guys think about supports? Those are the supports that get the most value because you can't get value out of the other supports given the circumstances. Like Zen can't get discords off behind shields, Anna can't shoot things and nade things with all the shields in the way. Mm -hmm. And and Mercy Mercy can heal through shields, right? Yep. Uh if you attach on before shield, before you go through uh, the shield, yeah. Okay. And then Yeah. Yeah. Um, and more can feed through shields. Almost. That's that's part of it, yeah. There's another part that I'm looking for, though. The main uh, part. I guess, like, Lucio, Lucio um, can reposition and get everyone back into the where they're holding. And, and Lucio has also the beat that could survive a lot of ultimates. Like, uh, I would say... Uh, Flux? Yeah, Flux, Flux and, and Flux and Blossom, yeah. All and right, also that's... Yeah, okay, there you go. Yeah, that's that's another point. Again, still not the main one though. There's there's one more. That is good though. It, Lucio's ult is the best for dealing with ults like sit like like flux and ults like reaper ult, right? He's, it's he's it's not a DLT, really it's a well. blanket give health. Luke, it's just it's speed, it's like enables the rest of his team to take space more efficient, efficiently. And not there's, the, there's the, a, the other one's gone. I, that's just building on the cat's point, yeah, yeah. But there's one, there's a specific word I'm looking for. You've, I guess, have already said it. Uh, survivability. Yes. It's not as it's the same, but yeah. Smart, smart. They're, they're the most efficient characters for enabling their team using their resources and consume resources from the enemy team, right? So this is the longer they are alive, the more resources they can consume from the enemy team, right? So this isn't just about Oh yeah, I anti so they have to bubble it, right? That's that's that is a use of resources. That is a trade of resources between the supports and the tanks, right? The enemy team's tanks. But even living still consumes, right? Attention and time, and still like pressure, creates pressure right? The, even just being alive as a support consumes resources from the enemy team. So the longer you stay alive, the more efficient you can be as a support, right? This is especially. Especially important with Anna, where Anna's kit is best used with rotating cooldowns, right? So the longer you're alive, the more times you can rotate through your sleep and your nade, right? Mm -hmm. Anna's kit gets more and more value as the team fight goes on, whereas Mora's kit gets less and less because she's slowly running out of resources, right? Yeah. But these fights are over so fast that Anna doesn't have time to use and rotate her kit like that, right? That's why Moira and Lucio are the best. Right? Lucio's ult is good for... Sustaining? Uh, sustaining, yeah. And getting through ults like Flux and Blossom and Meteor Strike and shit like that. And Moira has the best survivability out of all the off-supports. Even though she's not technically an off-support. Hmm. Yeah, it depends. Moira can be either. Same with Brig. All right. Positioning. This is the big one. This is the this is the really big one. Okay. This is the one that we need to apply the most in our game. Yes. <coughs> this is where this starts to make a whole lot more sense. <coughs> All right. Mm -hmm. Oh, who joined? I returned. Okay. With Coke. Nice. <laughs> and it's not the drink. What? But nice. <laughs> Got him, bro. <laughs> All right. Positioning is not just about where where to stand to get the most kills, easy shots, or be the safest, right? It's it's about enabling the kit of your hero, right? So this is what I went over with Sharp, right? Doomfist Doomfist positioning is about getting the most value out of his kit, right? That's that that's how you know where to stand and where to go, right? If you dive in as Doomfist, and you're on just the same level ground. You're just behind your team, right? You go in, you try to use your your E to like get damage on the enemy team. That's not a very good 
that's not a very good position, right? And so therefore your kit gets less value than it could have had you been on, you know, for example, a high ground, right? Your E takes longer, you get more damage on the E, you have better escapability because of your surprise, right? Your surprise attack. That's how you use this in game to figure out your own positioning. So uh no, not underlined it, turned it white. <laughs> All right. For those of you who didn't read that before I did that. Um, can you guys try to explain some other heroes to me? Using, like, thinking this way? With positioning, enabling the kit of your hero? Can you guys try to explain some other heroes to me? Like, for example, like Zarya or something like that? <clears throat> I guess the big one would be... Or Lucio? Lucio. Yeah. yeah. Um, hmm. Lucio gets the most value out of his kit when he can use when his kit affects more people, so being in the middle of a team to speed everybody gets more value than mm -hmm. not being with the team and speeding nobody. Then, you know, redditing. Yeah. <laughs> Smile. <laughs> but there is a time and place for redditing, right? But yeah. Reddit Lucio is fun. But when what? redditing, there's a time and place for redditing. It is, but there, there's a time and place for it. Yeah. Right? It's about risk versus reward, right? So you could be getting... Uh, like value from your hero by sitting in the middle of your team and healing them and speeding them, right? Or you could take the risk to get more value by booping someone off the ledge, right? That's, that's, it's not just like, oh, I'm just going to go for a flank just because they're close to the ledge, right? That's, that, that shouldn't be your thought process. Your thought process should be, right? Is it worth the risk to go for a boop, right? And a boop is using your resources to try and, get kills right it's it shouldn't just be oh, i want to reddit let's go dude <laughs> get, let's get that reddit clip <laughs> right it's a it's about resources so can you guys explain to me maybe another hero other than these two and lucio uh maybe enabling uh, what about what about genji genji all right sure of all the heroes to pick the dead hero is probably like <laughs> one of the worst but okay <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. I I will explain this one. How to All use right. Genji's kit properly? You go to your spawn and you switch. True. <laughs> <laughs> All right. How's your positioning a blade? Hmm? How's your positioning a blade? You press Q. You get slept by six different abilities. You get stunned and booped across the map and anti and hacked. And then you alt F4. Yeah. That's your positioning on Genji when you're blading, all right? There you go. Merry Christmas. Okay, but on the reels, you want to blade and hit targets where your team can give you resources to help your blade. And the enemy can yes. use the resources to kill you. Because if they have stuns, they can delete you. Yes. So, like, if you're going to blade into a McCree, you make sure your Zara can see you so she can bubble you. Yes. Basically, another thing is you want to wait for those sorts of abilities before you blade. Yes. Right. These are all very good points. And I haven't even written anything about Genji down, so this is all just off the top. Hey, I guess, top, yeah. I, I guess you could say I never This is Genji. all from watching like every guide on YouTube about Genji. <laughs> so why are we all still shit is the question. <laughs> because our because you're, you're, small. you're using it the wrong way. You're, th you're hearing this, right? Where you, Oh, I have to alt from the line of sight of my Zarya, and that's where your line of thought ends. That's where your train of thought ends. Before now. Now it keeps going, and you, you break down that rule that was just given to you, and you go, okay, why am I doing this? Right? Why am I... All it's not just so that she can give you bubble, right? It's so that your whole team can give you resources. It's not just abilities either, right? It's attention, right? Your Anna can give you attention by shooting you. That counts as attention, right? That's, that's what you're doing physically with your kit at that time. Hmm. Do you want to try another hero? What about like combos of heroes? So what it like like if it was let's say you're playing double sniper and you're standing and you're Hanzo and you're standing beside your widow, you get more value by standing, getting a crossfire so that your enemy's attention not looking at one line of sight, it's looking at. Mm hmm. Precisely. Precisely. Yeah. So you don't want to never be standing beside your widow as a Hanzo, basically. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that, like this this rule right that you're supposed to just oh I should just go to a different side. Just I shouldn't stand beside my widow as the Hanzo, right? You break down this rule and you go, okay, so why am I doing this? I'm doing this because 
they use them using resources, their team using resources on the widow negatively affects you as well if you're beside the widow. So now they have to split their resources and the efficiency of these resources that they're spending is cut in half at least, right? Because there's two of you now. There's two of you in different spots. And then you want to be in a position where you can get support from your from your team when those resources are eventually used on you. Yes. So like being inside of your Ana. Maybe oh, not inside your Ana, but yeah. Inside, inside. <laughs> no, definitely inside the Ana. Okay, granny style. <laughs> well, being inside your Ana, right? Let, let's continue this train of thought, right? Standing beside your widow increases their efficiency of resources on both of you, right? Because you're standing together, right? Now, why wouldn't you want to stand beside the Ana? Wait, I said it's inside. Oh, I thought you said inside. No, Scar was memeing me. I was like, <laughs> uh, maybe. But yeah, so that that's... Right, that's that's why you don't want to sit beside or like sit right inside your Anna the whole time, right? Because now the resources they use on you or your Anna affects you as well, right? If you're in a different position, you could use your resources to better peel for your Anna instead of, you know, dying with her when they get dove. And if they die, use a lot of resources to kill them, so you can maybe counter fight. Yeah. So you're standing in a separate spot, other than your widow and your Anna, right? You're you're standing by yourself, but it's but it's intentional right now, right? Before it was like, oh, just don't ever stand by yourself as a widow. Just play with your team, right? Now you know when to flank and why you're flanking, and where you need to flank, right? You need to flank where you can still get resources from your team once you've done your job or used your resources, and the reason you're flanking is to have your resources be much more efficient on their team than normal, right? So for example, if you're behind a shield, right? You're hitting a storm arrow and your resources are getting absolutely no value because you're just shooting a shield the whole time, right? But flanking doesn't just let you get kills on people who don't notice. It's the efficiency of your resources goes through the roof when you're flanking, right? Or that, it's Another more dangerous as well. It, exactly, right? Risk versus reward. It, another ver another version of this, to more extreme, right, is shatter. I'm sure you can understand why. <laughs> Flank shatter is extremely risky, but the efficiency of the shatter can go through the roof, right? When and you're flanking. And win the fight alone. With and shatter. win the fight with just shatter, and you get all your other alts off it, right? You need nothing else. But if it fails, you kind of just feed and lose the fight because of it. Yes. We're doing great, guys. Good job. <laughs> slowly. We're slowly getting there. It's a little bit slow at the start. Um, Alright. What, what do you guys think about Farah? She needs a lot of attention. She puts a lot of pressure into the enemy, depending on how their, mm -hmm. how their comp is, is made. So if there's, if there's no hard counter to Pharah, like a Bash or Macri or something that puts pressure on her, she's a lot of, she has a lot of space to move around and efficiently use her resources to get value. What could that value be? Uh, trading simple primary here. fire for cooldowns, yeah. attention, pressure. Positioning, since you kind of have to position well against a Pharah. Alt charge, possibly kills. Yeah. And if you get the Pharah out fast, you can win the fight with only that, if they don't have resources to put into you. Pog. <laughs> Alright. Loco's number one student. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Primo, your second, everyone else is last. That's one thing you didn't realize. say about Lucio. Lucio is a really good peeler. You can use a book to peel yeah. people off. And if you boop a Reaper, he basically has to fade out of play. So, can you guys repeat to me what you guys have written down so far? Well, except for maybe Kuz, because you tried to write down everything. <laughs> okay, yeah, dude. Kuz just... What, when I, when I paraphrase everything, everything, that's writing down everything. Okay. Bro, not everyone answer at once, dude. Okay. Yeah. Uh, okay. You don't want one of my notes. I'm all right. Doing uh, all I have resources and then the processes, time, space, cooldowns, etc. 
then efficiency, um, primarily of resources, and then positioning, so enabling the most hero to your kit, and then uh, get the most value out of your abilities. Full things I've down. So what did you write down for positioning? Enabling the kit out of your hero. Well, that's the purpose of your positioning, not to hold a certain area, but to like yeah. enable the kit of your hero. Maybe, so like, maybe, maybe really word that to uh, your positioning is decided by the value you get from your kit from where you are and where you want to go. Something along the lines of what uh, Sharp wrote down. If you have the paper, you can say it. I don't. I I can't quite remember what you wrote down. I still have the paper. Yeah, that would be pretty tilted if you didn't. <laughs> <laughs> like, it's Whoa, always all okay, it Yeah. All right. So I wrote down positioning is about maximizing the efficiency of my kit and getting the most value out of my, of my abilities. So something along those lines. Uh, but add on where from where you are now and where you want to go. I'm really sure if you could add that too. And this th this paper you guys are going to be reading uh, at least before every scrim and in between every map. If you guys aren't like, you know, talking about strategy and shit like that, if you have extra few seconds, reread the paper between the map. All right. You probably already said this, but I'm going to say it again. Remember, everything equals time. Yeah, that that's kind of just like everyone knows that, right? That's it's just... Hopefully. I mean, hopefully. <laughs> Times are like created by millennials. Shut up, <laughs> boomer. Wow. Okay, boomer. <laughs> All right, the, the, the link should be there for everyone. You should be able to click it. So we're going to watch about two minutes of this. And then everyone as a team, I want you guys to try to explain it the best possible to what's going on and why the teams are making the decisions they're making. This single fight? Okay. Yeah, well, this, sing this single fight's like two minutes. OK. All right, are you ready? Yep. Yeah. yep. Is anyone not ready? All right, we're good. All right, you ready? Three, two, one, go. We're gonna be watching for about two minutes. One thing that does give Team USA a slight advantage with the composition is that they are running a robot. That can be resurrected though. Yep, Evil Tile was there to bring Jinnu back, so as heroic as it was from Corey, he doesn't have a mercy to bring him back into the game. And China, with running a Roadhog instead of a Sigma here, doesn't have a secondary shield oh, yeah, to stand I don't on the point. Eileen's able to catch Raucus out now, and the USA are being whistled down. They try and throw a defensive shield towards oh, their backside that was spaced, taking care of business. USA control the point. It's yeah, hard back for China to really get in on them, but Jinmu's not in a great spot. Eileen cannot work these shields down. Well, Jinmu is actually going to nice for Corey, who come off the spawn. So Jinmu's playing a little bit of his own game in the back, where he feels Got like, him. okay, he's able to go get Corey. Now you can start to work back towards the High back. Expensive vision waiting down for the game down for the USA. China are going to come to one way or another. Can they... Cut them down to size before they reach them. Oh, oh looking good. Barrage time. Immortality field. Accretion's going to stop Jinmu midway through, but Eileen managed to get right into them with the shield down. So you can pass that to China win and try to take it. Get rid of the barriers. And in that instance, Team USA, they're forced My main train of thought that they are taking the fight slow because they can't engage on the Bastion since the Bastion is a result of pressure into the the sidelines he, he protects, mm -hmm. but the enemy, like the China comp is, out, is way better than the US comp in the sense of positioning a way to crossfire and take a lot of angles to put pressure on the enemy comp. And by the looks of things, the main win condition from them on China was the Barai, which in TNT executed. Mm -hmm. Okay guys, let's not let Loco explain everything. Yeah, dude. <laughs> 
Um, but yeah, so that they they can't push in because, uh, well, you know, Bastion puts a lot of, a lot of pressure on the front line and prevents you from rotating very easily. And there's also the fact they don't have resources to take Bastion on fire for yeah. like one second. So essentially, they have to focus down one, one each, like one of the targets. Um. Well, it, it wasn't that they had to. It was that Corey was in a spot where he could, where Jinmu could kill Corey, and Jinmu went for it. Right. Usually, that's not a very good idea for a Pharah to hard dive a widow. Right. That's usually not a very good idea. But right. But Jinmu. Well, he, he, he holds tab and he sees that they don't have a mercy, right? So if he, even if he trades, which is what ends up happening, right, for this widow, he can be rezzed and Corey can't, right? That's it's it's risk versus reward, right? The actual re the actual reward of getting Corey is very high, but the risk isn't very high either because China has mercy and USA doesn't, right? The main question that I want you guys to explain to me is why did China let the U.S. take the point. It was because intentional. They, they, because they have a Bastion, and the Bastion controls space really efficiently, and the China comp can take space really well against that. No, it was an intentional plan. It wasn't them just letting the U.S. run them over. They weren't forced to do it by the Bastion. They intentionally let USA take the point. Because since they were 65 over time, they're have more resources to put in the fight, so the longer the fight goes on, the more of an advantage is to, so instead of hard engaging on them, they can take the long fight. They can still end up winning that way in, in the long run, rather than if they just hard engage on the Bastion, they risk losing really quickly. Alright, take a little bit deeper, a little bit deeper. That That's good though, you're on the right track. And the, if you take the fight to a longer time, the US uses a lot more resources to keep the Bastion alive, because they are putting a lot of pressure into the comp. What is what does the what does China falling back behind cover let the team do? Poke. I don't know. It, it recharges their resources. Falling behind cover, right, lets them recharge their hull. It recharges their their shields, right, their hook, their cooldowns, all their abilities, right. It, they recharge all the resources, right. So does Moira. Re Moira recharges resources by not having to heal the team, right. So. They back off, let USA take the point. China, while the US is taking the point and sitting there, is regening resources. And at the same time, Jin Mu's building his barrage. And they do this from about 65% of far barrage is when they let them take the point around there. And the reason they do this is because they're within, it's, it's just around the time where if China falls back, they will have the resources to help Jimmu by the time Jimmu gets his barrage. This is an intentional decision to walk off the point and to let them have it. So the rest of China, after they cap the point, is regening resources, and Jinmu is working as hard as he can to try and get his barrage as fast as possible. And you'll see, once he has it, China jumps back onto point, two people on point, Jinmu pops Barrage, and Kaio pops Coalescence to help Jinmu, right? These are, like, th they put the resources all at once. And the only reason they were able to do this and put all of their resources all at once into the U.S. was because they fell back and let them have the point. You guys remember watch that? Does that make sense to everyone? Yes. For me, though, yes. The, the reason they mm -hmm. let the USA have the point was to regenerate resources to allow Jim Moot to have his barrage actually work. Had China not fallen back and regen these resources, Jim Moot basically guaranteed would have died instantly the moment he hit Q. And they would have gotten nothing off it. Maybe the immortality field cooled down, but that's about it. And they would have lost their fight. And they would have lost the fight. So this might look even, but it's not. And now that the Bastioner is on the attack, they have a huge advantage. So even though they're at the same percentage the next fight, right? When the next fight's like halfway through, they're at the same percentage. They're actually 
China is at an advantage because the USA has to set up and that costs them. They lose the next fight because they are on attack with Bastion and aren't able to set up easily. Because for the Bastion, it takes resources for him to set up. And if they so in, those in, in the end, they get to 85% because they lost a fight. Have to find kills with the barrage, just get rid of the barriers. And in that instance, Team USA, they're forced to respect Jinmu in the sky. They know the barrage is coming. All right. And they also have the damage that's coming down from the Roadhog, the Orisa, and then the Widowmaker. Also, you cannot just let Eileen have free lane. So, these shots. how do we use these things in game? Right? When you're positioning, the main thing you want to think about is. Can my kit get the most value from where I'm positioned right now, right? Is there a more p efficient place to be? So this is like super, super relevant on heroes like, you know, McCree and Soldier, right? Where if you're just sitting behind your shield, your kit can get value from where you are, but being on a high ground could be much more efficient. Like your resources get a lot more value by being on the high ground. So see, see how I'm taking these rules that soldiers should be on a high ground and turning them into resources, right? I'm breaking them down and seeing the original reason to why you're putting the soldier on the high ground. So if he sits behind the shield, he's putting a low pressure onto the enemy and getting basically no value. But he's, if he's sitting on high ground, he's putting a lot more pressure into the enemy comp. Exactly. And using less resources, I guess. This, is, this isn't uh, that helpful for heroes like Soldier, but for heroes like, for like Winston, right, and Doomfist, can my resources give me... Like, can my team give me resources from here, and can they give me resources from where I want to go, right? So that's that's when you're deciding where to jump, right, or who to, like, who to jump on. This this is a question you need to ask yourself before you hit the button, right? Can my team give me resources from where I want to go, and do I actually need them, right? If you're jumping on like a one HP Mercy in a corner, right, it's not you don't really need the resources, right? Like to finish while you're finishing up the fight, but on your first engage, right, this question is very important. It's very, very important. It's a little example. I just, I didn't bother removing it, but you can read it if you want. All right, sticky note time. These three questions should be on the sticky note. I'm just going to add to that a little bit. These are the three questions that you got that you need to write down on the sticky note. So this stuff, everything before this should be like paraphrased on the little piece of paper that you read in between maps. But this stuff is on the sticky notes that you should read in between every team fight. And you'll know you don't need these anymore when you zone out after a team fight and you just see the sticky notes and know what they mean already. You're instantly your brain instantly goes into the analytical thinking mode. I'm assuming everyone's writing on the sticky notes, I hope. <laughs> yep, I am. I am. And we've got 15 minutes until the scrim. All right, they canceled the scrim. Nice. What? what? Like two minutes ago. I got a DM while I was doing that, and I didn't look. Oof. Uh, yeah, I'll find another one. We have, let's, we have 15 minutes. I'll find another one. That, that sucks. Can I play like the first two or last two? Or first half, last half, whatever it is.
Uh, unless you guys want to do a 10, 10 o'clock stream. Also, who, uh, hang on. That was Sadiv, right? That was Sadiv. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'm just I, I haven't known you guys for long enough. So I'm still learning which one's which. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just doing schoolwork, so whatever. It's like, so as long as I'm not like okay. on and off break time to play, then. Well, here, you can continue your schoolwork, I guess, and then we'll put you in for a second half. Okay. <laughs> okay, I'm done with writing that down. Alrighty, stick it to the side of your monitor. <laughs> Smile. Yeah. You don't have to stick it on the glass, obviously. <laughs> Never I mean, I, I can do that on my monitor, at least anywhere but the bottom, because it, it goes right to the outside, the actual film on the edges. Uh, yeah, I'll find one, it's fine. Flat the world! I mean, you are in like 10 different servers for them. Yeah. I'm in like every server that's ever existed. Do you guys want a 4.3k team? Do you guys feel ready? No. <laughs> I don't know about that one. Do you guys want a 10 o'clock scrim and get some more warm up in or? As long as it's over by 12. Yeah. Well, it would end at 12. Anyway. Then it worked. Yeah, <clears throat> let's get some warm up because I haven't warmed up my voice or anything yet. This is AM4, right? Alright. And then I can watch and give you guys feedback. They'll actually matter now, Pug. Pug. Assuming all this stuff sticks in your head. I sort of still can't believe that Genji is so bad that the game won't even let Necros play it. <laughs> Wait, did this guy actually just do that? What? He did. Spoiler okay, no, alert. I, I mislooked at it. Uh, I, I, thought, I thought he posted. I thought he posted looking for a scrim like one minute ago, and then I DM'd him, and he goes, "Oh yeah, we already found one." Sorry, bro. Uh, who's missing from the group? You know, Marcus throwing. Sharp's throwing. I am. I was watching. The like cast throwing. I'm getting on. Time to test out my bear. I was watching the right? montage. So no, regular. regular. The PTR scrums are like generally a terrible idea. And kind of pointless. 
not according to Brutal. I'm back. <laughs> Who's left? You know. <laughs> I mean, I, mean, I, I realized, realized like half of the stream. Yeah, no one knows what the meta is going to be. People, people are just, just doing random shit. Ninety-five percent of the cops you played, you probably won't be running an actual yeah. live service. But then I just started a meme on Ryan and Flank Shatter and shit. And then I pinned the fire out of the sky. Oh, look at that fire truck you hit on the Mercy. I was watching it from behind the Mercy. Bruh. Okay, so before every fight, I want you guys to look at the... No, I'm, I'm spectating you guys, man. Okay. Oh, wait, yeah, why did you suggest... Oh, wait, do you want me to warm up on different count? Uh, sure, it doesn't matter. I'll, I'll just be on the main. Uh, you, you guys good? just do all that without me. Okay. Wait, yeah, who's second? Sure, I'll be also in the studio was near. Look, I was throwing. Wait, I'm farming. Jesus. <sighs> His game takes like 70 years, Logan. God, you know. Played like a game without knowing us. Okay. Yeah, we could probably fit in a game without. Yeah, you know, we could fit in a game without you. Yeah. yeah. Oh my fucking god. Oh, wait, hold on. I'll play tank. The oh, primo can play Please. DPS. Yeah. No, no, it's okay. Well, you guys need six with loco, so just join loco. I'll just spectate or something. Okay. Good job. Oh yeah, my playing. god. Loco started playing Overwatch. You know, loco started playing Overwatch. Why not stop? Did you already load? Did already load it? No, not yet. Ina, please Best get a better time. computer. My hard drive from like 2012. Oh my god. Fuck you. No, you. <coughs> Estimated time for Logo to uh, log in is about five years. About five years. You know, are you in the main menu yet? Still, still Re loading. Re. Re. What the fuck? Sunrise, shut up. <laughs> I was gonna do this. I was gonna do no, I was gonna do the thing where, where you do and just fucking jump off the map and just get it. Sorry, go invite me. About Final. So do you, do you guys think you can uh, all combine your brains and try to tell me how target priority works in Overwatch then? Kill things. You're just going for it. Um, I mean, how to know what to shoot and when to shoot I get, it. I, get, I, guess, uh, I already have this written down, so... Yeah, well, yeah, that's what I mean, we're like, you already know it, so... Are we applying the resource thing that we just... Yeah, oh, yeah so it'd be things yeah. with not enough resources to survive or like... That no, can't get enough resources from their teams. We target say like who you can kill, kill with the least amount of resources on your team, and that would pull the most resources out of that enemy team. That's that's pretty close. Yo, that's just about. The way I would phrase it though is, um, who on the enemy team provides the most resources to their team, right? So shooting shooting a, a Hanzo, 
<clears throat> just sitting there in the middle of the team, right, and shooting a Baptiste who's off on, like, the, the back ledge, right? The Baptiste is obviously going to give you much, like, you're going to take a lot more resources out of their team shooting the Baptiste than the Hanzo. The Hanzo is very easily, like, um, tended to, right, by their team. He's right in the center, he can be helped by their tanks and their healers, right? The Baptiste on the high ground that we just said. Shooting the Baptiste, right? The Baptiste position doesn't allow him to get very many resources from his own team, right? And on top of that, the Baptiste picks out a lot more resources from their team than the Hanzo does, right? With the Baptiste out of the fight. Yep, they have, they lose uh, healing and metallic field. I have a Zarya, Junk Road. Feeding us too. Oh. Is there no personal? No bubbles. Watch him behind still. Tell him to the right. Push Hanzo, push Hanzo. Hanzo, Hanzo. I'm a Hanzo. Hanzo, 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 Hanzo. Perhaps a new methodology is required. Thank you. Not bad. Not bad. Hit him on point. I'm going point. I'm going back with. Get the Lucy, get the Lucy, Lucy, Lucy. 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 I'm kind of back a point. Jack, huh? Gotta pull. Hanzo, or uh, Hammond in right, Hammond in right. Oh, what? Nice. Uh, I got a scrim for 10. A nice. nice. I always have collectors. I was coming in. There are no press, no. There are main. Hammond behind. Hammond right. This will heal you. Okay, behind us. We can push on there. Dark's also behind you guys. Oh, behind you, behind you, careful. I'm on John. Dark's half. Battle back in. You only have more air, careful. Go back up, go back up. The next match, uh, the next outlet match you guys play, right, is in like two weeks? Uh, no, next Sunday. So a week from tomorrow. A week from tomorrow, okay. That was a good lead. Oh, also, I can clear mine. Shit, it. Yeah, hog on back up point. They nanoed the ball. Closed it. I'm dead. Sorry, he's speeding, he's speeding. Watch the tire. Tire's one. Huge. Push 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 Two ultimates, one. No ultimates. Push the hog, push the hog. Oh boy. David, stick around. Hog, go, go, go. Hog, 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 hog. Hog, hog, hog. There you go. Ooh, I'm ending. It's, uh, that's week, that's week two, day one, right? Next week? Walk that. Counts as week two, day one. Fox, can I push it? Fox, can I push it? Pull Fox? Yeah. Guys, which G Fuel flavor should I drink? Oh I have three. Uh, what flavors do you have? I have uh, Rage and Gummy Fish inspired by Phase Jev. Sour Blue Chug Rug inspired by Phase Rug. And Tropical Rain. Bro, do the Chug Rug. Yeah, whatever gets you diabetes or the heart attack faster. Like, take that one. Well, <laughs> alright. She feels actually pretty good. It's not good for you, but it's not bad for you. It's a healthier alternative to Monster. Which I, I used to drink a lot of. Acid is a healthy alternative to Monster. <laughs> this is also true. Have us our Sigma. We can just go point. Yeah, Sigma, oh, they point. 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 They TP yeah, point. Oh, get the Sims. Sim, sim. Who's first? Sim, Sim, Sim. Uh, Who's your first? Who's your first? Who's your first? That's on top. Uh, I got you. Is that one no personal? Is that no personal? 
Oh, Jake Sigma no shit. Halfway. Bring one on pulling her. Rick one. Rick top. Be careful, be careful. Oh. I can shield. Oh, wow. Uh, we got our map pulled, by the way, so we can play all the maps for Sunday's match. Nice. Jepped cool. off. Alright, we push on coalescence. Easy. There was a flaw in my approach. Yeah, wrong. Like, just only like for a couple of days. Didn't FaZe Jev get in trouble for something recently? Mm -hmm. Hey Kuzo, why are you coalescing here? What, why, why are you coalescing? Because you win the short fight, they have Ana. Speed in, speed in. I'm trapped. Sigma, 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 Oh, be careful, Sack. Speeding, speeding! He's one. Sigma, huh? Nice. Hold on. Here. I'm sleeping. Push up, so. Down the personal. 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 Down can I have a little? I'll shield him too. Yeah, I'll take again. Uh, I'm stunned. Back to point, back to point, back to point. Oh, they need a sig. I'm back in three. Aw, man. Oh, oh shit, open it, they're open it. They win. Die fast, die fast, die fast. I got the block. Yeah. I always have colors. Uh, pull the flux coalescence to keep us alive. They should have tire. Yeah. There, there has no yeah, personal. Like, Put one there, bro. Alright. Three, two, one, pull. Shooting, 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 shooting. Best for shield. Zara, Zara, Zara. 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 Zara, why did she take that one? Help me. You seem in need of aid. I'll call one. Super. Sorry, no bubbles. Yeah. yeah. Super, 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 super reaper. Take the fight in here. Take the fight in here. Hey, someone. Hey, wait for the grab. We have no bubbles. Three seconds. Just take my, take my one. We don't need ults. We don't need ults. Break. Break one. Break one. Go ahead. I'm good. Junkrat's on the right. Yeah, Junkrat, get the Right now, right now, Lucio. Yeah, yeah. on their right as well. Back up, back up, back up, back up. I'm back, I'm back. Have ball, no projected. What's going right? You got three ults coming up. They want you to ult. They want you to point. Back up. We're going to fight. Go point then. I can call it. Call us. Yeah. Call us. Push in, push in, push in. Just push into them. Push uh, them. Get, get your blast, get your blast. Sorry, one, sorry, one. Sorry, got nano. Are they dead? We can burn, uh, we can oh, burn, sorry. Sorry. Watch point, watch point, watch point. I'm dead. Just hammer, just hammer. Ball, ball, ball. Kill ball, kill ball. Nice. I have luck for. Nice. Nice. <laughs> what did we learn today, Sharp, about that doorway? Uh, it's bait. <laughs> oh, why? Why would you? <clears throat> this is a question for everyone. Why would you not push through that doorway? What's bad about that position? Past the doorway. Uh, small enclosed area. Do, with do a junk kick, right. But with why is that bad? Hat. Your team can't give you resources. Yeah, it's hard for yes. Doofus to get value from a skip there. <clears throat> Well, it's not necessarily hard for Doom because there's walls everywhere, right? It's it's the resources they put into you are amplified like crazy when you're yeah. in that room. Oh, the junk rat existing doesn't make that that tiny little hallway bad. It's it's the fact that the resources that they use on you when you're there are extremely effective, which is why you die in staying instantly like Sharp knows when you go through the doorway. He went to punch through, he punched right into a trap and died instantaneously. Yup. That was a cute little meme. Ooh. 
Yeah, I got confused for a second. That that <laughs> actually confused me. <laughs> I wasn't quite sure what was going on. All right. It's just time, me. To, time to have some <gasps> blue chug rug. <laughs> Bro, I'm sitting here, dude. I got a 12 pack of Nest tea. Nest tea. That's where it at. That's where it's at, dude. I probably should get the fucking lid. Goddamn lids. <sighs> Goddamn lids, bro. God. Some of the normal G fuels are kind of like sour, so like. What is a sour one? Are actually you a G getting? fuel connoisseur? <laughs> no, I, I like literally just started getting it. I gotta start back. To try it out. Bro, you should get Rogue Energy. Use code MINEPUNKS for 10% <laughs> off at checkout. <laughs> Bro, dude, I love Bamsy. I, I'll, of course I'll promote his shit. I wanted to get the PewDiePie G Fuel Cup, but <laughs> they were sold oh, wait, out. Does, does MINEPUNKS have a link I can like? I'm pretty sure they do. Oh, you can just ask Bamsy. Defense on Icon. Yonkies. Ugh. Yo, it's the same guys. Yeah. I didn't even notice. <sighs> Science will reveal the truth. Oh, this one doesn't taste that good. <laughs> <laughs> Oh no, dude. Attackers incoming. Bro. 30 seconds. What are we even running? Double shield re. Bastion. Uh, we don't have a bat. Yeah. Uh, or a mercy. Healer's throwing, bro. I was auto pilot mode, bro. <laughs> I, I added Bamzy in the in the general chat and goes, Yo, dude, I need a link to Rogue Energy sponsorship so I can spam it to somebody who drinks G Fuel. My turn. <laughs> I bet have you guys heard of Raid Shadow Legends? Dude, I love Raid Shadow Legends. It's my favorite mobile RPG or whatever. <laughs> Did you guys see that Moira orb? That was pretty epic. Yeah. High value orb. He's a zone orb. It's only for the fair one. I'm gonna pull the junk card out. Oh, he's won. Huge. They're going around us. Only Zara is around. Only Zara is behind. Nah. No, Zara is behind. Two, three, flank. Left side. Right, 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 right here, right here, right here. Three, two. Kill. I'm full though. You can pull. That's right. I'm a dead. I can see his fucking hammer through the wall. Get him. Yee. Where's one? Come here, Mora. Their junk is over there on the left. For your safety, the oh, Their coach started spectating and watched them get rolled and then stopped spectating. <laughs> Ult F4, just like Ruby. Fuck! I was... I was gonna make an... You're going ball now. Oh, uh, ball? No. I'll watch for Bulbs, by the way, behind. Yeah, he's coming. Oh! Nice. I'm gonna stay on top. Oh, you have a Sombra? Sombra. I can shoot. I have a backup. So you can set up, set up, set up, set up. You're gonna drop it in the Yeah, I'm dropping. Why no shield? Why is one? Watch Shark in the right, careful. He's in the middle of it. I'm shielding okay. lamp. And dad shield up. Yo, I'm too. I'm gonna pull the bat on the right. Jack's right. Keep keeping alive, alive. keeping alive. Guys, dead. I don't know if we didn't have immortality field there. Yeah, also, how do we let Junk Rat jump into the middle of us, run circles, and then leave for free? Oof. So they're not sponsored by anyone anymore because everyone benefited way more off of us saying use code MINEPUNKS for 10% off of Rogue Energy. Like, Rogue benefited a lot more than MINEPUNKS did, so they're not represented by anyone anymore. Maybe it's Skipper just dead. Ooh! Watch for a buff again. But how? How did I get slipped? Bruh, that's some bullshit. Don't go left. 
gonna pull above on car. Bala, Bala. Yeah, pull flux when we day push him. Pull dead. Watch the junk. I can pull the junk on the right. Junk's nice. Right behind us, right behind us, right behind us. I wanted you to get pinned by that. <laughs> I saw it coming from like a light year away. Oh, epic widow shot, guys! Back to the high ground, left side. And a palm. Let me show you how it's Careful done. it. Bob stop. Oh, Shaman, Hammond, 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 if you hit all of them, I'm gonna pull this back lower. I'm chasing him. I need one. Wait, back up, back up, back up. Siege. Yeah, I'm gonna try pulling it. Hey, someone's on cart. Oh, oh shit. Haha, oh, ha, it's him. Oh. I got that. You guys got that. On the ball. Oh, wow. I'm gonna try pulling the sneaky. Oh, he's like, oh, he's one. like one. Oh, Diva. All better. Amplification matrix ready. I missed my shell. Careful, Sai. Careful, Sai. You're not in the shield at all. Uh, they're trying to pull out of that. Diva behind. Diva behind. Pull it. Pull it. Pull it. So, okay. they're pushing cart part two. Please, oh, guys. Oh, fuck. Okay, <laughs> sure. No, I can't. Oh, I hit him at the shield. No, I can't. No, I can't. I watched that entire thing. Go, no. I'm you so bad. That, Sorry? You saw that? I was like, no, no, Those aren't not size. I was watching. 2 HP, I'm 2 HP. Oh. Damn, I got melee. Kill her. Kill the widow. Uh, you let us say dead. You let us say. Oh, uh, uh, oh, mega. Are we, are we, are you? Guys, are throwing. You can go stomping all that damn Bastion. Bastion's dead. Bastion's dead, Omega Wall. Junk, right, left side, junk, left side, junk, left side. Four tonight is dead, crab rave. Hey, they have Wally Worlds. Matrix early, Matrix early, because we're gonna stop off this. Matrix early. Yep. Matrix. I can shoot this. Give it one. Get the bottom riddle. Lana. I'm gonna try to pull her out. I need one. Wally. I'm gonna shoot their minds. I'm gonna shoot their minds. I'm gonna Watch out for the fire. Map one. Okay. Two okay. lamp and ten back. Sharp, dude. I'm Ball sorry, Yambe. Yeah, I watched that whole thing. One. David behind. The She's left side. She's in the back of this room. David in the back. This might have been a bad idea. No, I just can't aim right now. No, sorry, get the fuck out of here. I don't care. Little live, little live. Get the back, get the back. Re okay. Can you guys kill them? No need, we win the fight. It is stall. Time. Yeah. Get some resource, guys. Hey, exactly. Re locked again. Sim? Wait, what's she gonna remake? Okay, moral charge. Easy mode. Exactly. Resources. Travel team, I've got flux. There's one. I have one fight. Will you pull for flux when ever, bro? Who do I am? Hold on. Oh. Watch your left side. Buzz on my trap, buzz on my trap. Let them out. Watch him, watch him. Hold the sim. Sim's up, Sim's up. Sim's up. Sim's up. Sim's up. Sim's up. Sim's up. Sim's feeding. Him behind you. Ball, ball, ball. I'm pulling the Anna. Ball, Sim's right side. Jungle left side, jungle left side. When they push him, we flux. And I'll bulk. I have a metallic head. Come pull for flux. Let me that fill up. Uh, yeah, I gotta pull push down. Push him, push him, push him. You have Valk, you have Valk. Push him. Push, 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 push. Sam, Sam, Sam. Fall out, fall out. Next, right side. Sharp, this is the third trap you died from. I'm still on the right. You just placed that one. You did one. No, leave her. Just leave her. Oh my god. Oh, we're gonna try to fill up. 
Well, nice. okay. Alt charge when I already have my ult. Exactly. I have Matrix. This fight. I'm Matrix when they push it. Yeah, mix it surely. Dragon first, just to see like if we can do whatever. Yeah. And then we should have the engage. Hammond on left, careful Hammond on left. I can move behind. I'm I got clear mines. I got my clear mines. Oh, team is left side, team. Kill Sim, kill Sim, kill Sim. Uh, below, below, below. Drop a few dragons through that. Alright, alright. What? I'm dead. I'm gonna start to hit the through the window. Yeet. Does it even do anything? No, it doesn't. It, it boosts the actual arrow, but not any of the damage from oh, the. Oh, really? No. Then you can kill people with the different sources of damage. It's like, well, you can't, div can't damage boost the diva bomb. Push in, push in, push in! Watch, watch ball, hop, hop. Breaking some um, noise. Diva, diva no boost. Watch Lucia behind. Long Sam, kill Sam. I'm back, I'm back. Sim half. They lost, they lost. Back up, back up, back up. Sim. Oh. Sim behind, Sim behind, Sim behind, both up top, watch the tire, watch the tire. Because <laughs> why are you mercy? <laughs> I'm out. Yeah, Fucking troll. Oh, the Bastion. Yeah. Yeah. And then he didn't swap for the rest of the Well, we, I didn't die until like the last fight, and the last fight I had Valk, and it's like our only like ult that we had. I got his skill. He's just shooting at the same place! <laughs> if three diamond portraits and two platforms. Fuck. I'm the only one without a fucking silver border. Oh my yeah, you noob. Freaking noob, dude. <laughs> that, that, guy has, that guy has been a plaid junk rat one trick since oh, season sorry, three. Okay. Epic! <laughs> Wait, in season. This guy just chooses heroes and just plays them. Like he has, oh, he has seasons where it's just only Zarya and nothing else, and then he has seasons where it's only Junkrat and not a single second of anything else. I hate those people. Just don't pay attention to the fact that I was a uh, plat from season nine till eighteen. Wait, can I? Have I was never game? a plat. The... Be in the next game. No. I was masters for like okay. two years. Uh, fuck. Uh, who's who's dropping? Game. Okay. Okay, I'm ready. I started to play this game and then went straight to the fucking diamond. There is just one day where. Cool. I decided to play comp even though I was like silver, and then I just destroyed everything. <laughs> Got to plat, and then I was stuck there. Yeah, Um, okay, so tomorrow, um, we're gonna go over, um, uh, a little bit of target priority, and, um, we're gonna talk about mechanics. What are those? I can't technically make your mechanics better, but I can stop you from fucking yourself over. Until you I like fucking myself over. 
<clears throat> Good shoes. Ruby, how much do I fuck myself over? You guys all probably have made it way harder than it needs to be on yourself. Wait, for what, sorry? For mechanics. But, like, what were you talking about? Oh, I, I can't technically make your mechanics better, but I can stop you from making them worse. <clears throat> and I can stop you, I can stop you from doing things that are stopping you from improving. Mm. Such as? Because I heard you say that, but I hear your first sentence. My um, mechanics are okay, and then my brain is small. Well, mechanics always look better to the person who's playing the game, because you don't notice. Like, it's, it's especially if you watch yourself back in first person, you'll notice how bad your aim really is. Yeah. And, like, my aim really isn't that good. It, but it, it feels good to me, because I'm the one playing it. But it, when I actually watch my own games back, my aim isn't actually that great. Because I don't really think about the aim. I mean, it's not even me who thinks that. One of Bean Brutal's first coaches messaged me saying, uh, Sharp, Pushin, speeding, 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 go through. Oh, you're stupid. I'm gonna put you behind, behind, behind. Nice, nice. Can I ask what, 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 what SR or a call? Is that coach? Head? Personal goal. Oh, yeah. I mean, where are we? Qualifications or experience? Rank that coach head. Nice, nice. We can push in. Speeding, speeding, speeding. I don't remember what. Good point. I think he was Masters. I'm on Risa. Risa's one. So he's never actually seen like better mechanics than that. So that kind of makes sense. You just won't let him have any mechanics or masters. What do you mean? Yeah, but there's not mechanics aren't the difference between diamonds and masters. What do you mean so, that I'm playing no. on mechanics or my brain mechanics? Brain mechanics, dude. Brain mechanics, brain mechanics, yeah. That's just game. And mechanics are speeding in. Mechanics doesn't just mean. High ground. It's the, the like ability. Hug back right, hug back right. Hug back right alone. Go nothing. Two hog, two hog, hog, hog. Hug no heal, hug no heal. Where's she missing? Where's the Where's the den? Where's the den? Hug no hook, hug no heal. Where's the fortify? Speeding in, speed Risa, speed Risa! Ash on top. Easy. See what game sense does? We roll quick play games in 90 seconds. But you lost the last one. It's because I was. <laughs> <laughs> what did I do? Like me mechanics isn't just aim. It's it's your ability usage too, right? It's like putting putting the maywall in the right spot, or like landing a doom punch, or like you know missing your left clicks on Sigma, missing your rocks, putting your shield slightly too far forward or slightly too far back. That's still all classifies as mechanics. Flag. I was masters in PTRE. Um, it yeah. doesn't matter, you fucking. <laughs> you know, are you hacking? I just saw your aim snap. Like, are you yeah, hacking? my sensitivity is super low, by the way. No, it's called his grip is Parkinson's, and his sensitivity is. <laughs> <laughs> Grips to help Parkinson's. So there's palm grip, there's claw grip, there's fingertip, and then there's Parkinson's. Yeah, fucking this, abomination. Guy has one, this guy has his. Like for his his mouse is like flipped over Logo, and he's what is moving that? his hand on the bottom of the mouse to move his mouse around. I'm pretty sure I already sent this server. If you can see somewhere. He's so cute. Point, this is your I defense can, like a monkey. I can probably find it yeah. on Ruby Chat. What? In your chat, I probably can find my fucking amazing fucking group. Oh yeah. I remember you guys telling me to try using claw grip, but I still don't do it. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I'm aware. Did I use claw grip. I use an abomination. Everyone of should. Grip. You're missing out on a third of your arm. I use an abomination of a grip. You shouldn't use my grip. Yeah, dude, this guy's sitting here with like a literal crab grip, dude. I don't know the difference of hands. So I don't understand how palm people use just their finger for it. Well, you're gonna learn. Yes, yeah, finger tip is just finger. Claw is uh. like finger tip plus palm and palm is palm. Wait. No, it's if claw is is you're using just your fingertips. The only things that actually touch your mouse are their fingertips. You're yeah, still right. using your wrist and you're still using your arm, but the only things that are in contact with the mouse are your fingertips. Okay. 
Because if you, if you play with palm, right, where your fingertips don't move at all and the mouse is against your palm, right, if you can still feel the mouse and move the mouse without your fingertips touching it, then you're using palm. Yeah, that's not dying. If you can move it at all. Yeah, mine is palm, basically, then. Yeah. I just want. But when you're using palm, you're, you're, missing, you're missing out on the extreme, like, precision of your fingertips. Box up. Oh, hey, I'm using... Box I fell, I fell, I fell. I'm using crab then, because... Crab... <laughs> yeah. Crab is, is Loco's weird version of... Claw that isn't He's actually dying. claw. Is that abomination? Well, I guess I'm palming, but like, I... My fingertips are on it. Like, I can't move it around with my fingers pushing. Yeah, well that's... that's... Palm, yeah. If your palm is touching it, then it's palm. Okay. That just so feels weird a, my palm not be on it. Well, yeah, I don't really like, know. Of course it's gonna feel weird, because you've never aimed like that before. Well, see, I don't know, because it's like low to the ground. It's not quite touching it, but it's like really, really, really close to touching it. Like, it's not like... Table leg, it's like... You, you, you'll be able to know if your fingers look like a Missy, 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 one. Missy, no, fade. More in the fade. Missy, Missy, monkey. What did that get this ball? Like I, I can plant, I can plant my palm on the table, and I can still completely move and aim properly. You use your, you use your, your arm for things like 360s or like, uh, like wide flicks, right? When like yeah. traces on you, and then you use your wrist for target acquisition and your fingertips for actually aiming at their head. Which is also why you guys hit body shots all the time. Smile. But I don't need aim. Me, fucking... me. You do. No, no matter what you say, you you need aim. More no fade and dive more. Yeah, I'll play monkey. Any healing? More is one more dead. That's a one. Fucking no hope. Go listen, go listen. Fuck off. Is there high. a reason that I started using uh, I'm a this hog. game and my accuracy went up to forty percent <laughs> rather than like twenty? I'm the ball, 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 ball uh, upstairs. Getting the spawner in bitches. <laughs> yeah, come back, ball. Back. I got the bomb. Claw well, doesn't actually feel that bad if you got it with. Well, it'll just feel better and better the more you use it, so. Yeah. There's like yeah, two pros that do. There's like two pros that don't claw, like one of them's like Ugh. Custa, so... Custa? I'm gonna bomb this. Yeah, dude, the Lucio player, so... Yeah. The only, like, one of the only pros that don't claw is a Lucio player. So there you go, that's... Take your hand. What's the other one you said to? I don't know. I don't know the other one. But I don't think I... I'm I, 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 no, I know Custa does gold. Arsenal gold? And I don't think it's Watch point. Miss Moira is one. No, sure for the pump grip. I'm right behind you, sure? 100%. I don't he think so. He had like a video explaining like how to aim and stuff, and he showed his hand and whatever. I know on. he uses like. Isn't that video from like 2017? <laughs> oh. oh, yeah, let's get dying okay. again. It well, it well, that's that my, that's my first death. Grab on my heels. Law, Basic like principles of aiming techniques two years ago. Yeah. yeah. September 2017. Susan, Susan. Uh, they're pushing cart. Mahog. Yeah. Come back. I need those okay. Though. Oh, um, I guess I'll just cap if I can. That's that. Wow. Evan Hanza. Where you go? How to play Genji, die as soon as you press Q. That's much better. We don't miss a fucking mech. What the uh, fuck? Hanzo's 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 main? I can jump on the Hanzo. Oh, yeah. the hog went higher. Hanzo is below. Oh, what oh. do you stop? I'm on Hanzo. Shut up, shut up. Oh, I see you. I'm because I've been killed. I'm definitely. You don't have it, just Lucio, be careful. Hug behind, careful. Hug behind, I'm a hog. You help behind, you help behind. Hug no heal. Three stairs. Hug one. 
Oh, it is main. He's a long spaceship now. Oh, no. I'm the house, I'm the house, I'm the house. 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 Mercy's one. Watch out for the other We're gonna set up a bomb, bomb man. How's this left side? How's this one? I have call lessons. We're gonna set up a bomb, bomb man. If they push in, just tell me. Hog is right. Uh, Hanzo top, Hanzo bottom left. Hanzo half. Call lessons. Push your tanks, push your tanks! Go, 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 go. We just left side, high ground, left side, high ground. Got a lot Oh, I got hook! Ah. Uh, the hot rock, no hook, he ulted. No heals. We gotta back up. Yeah. We must all make sacrifices in the name I'm of coming back. Healing orb at you, you both. Just the lane fail. We don't have. Ah, uh, no the hook. We have the hook. Push is one. Like, had you might want to think about changing your kit. My what? <laughs> Wait, <laughs> why do you play Moira? Yeah, I, I was about to ask. Like, shouldn't we be playing like Honor? Or Is he actually like, throwing? There's such an intense amount of high ground there. It's like. How's the other one? How's the one? Oh, it's no gold. Oh, it's oh, a gold. Oh, no gold now. No gold. No gold. More car, more car. We're in the fight. More... Amping speed, amping speed, pushing. Watch out for. Come on, Moira. Miss this one. Got it, got it, got it. Hug in the corner, hug in the corner. Ah, he tried to hook me. Ah, hook me out. Got you. Watch Riddle, man. Riddle's on Shadow. I have Coalescence. Uh, Coalescence is push in, we can push him. Yep. Uh, watch it, it was sniper though, watch it, it was sniper. Amping speed, amping speed. Hanzo oh, and cart. Hanzo and cart, Hanzo and cart, low, Hanzo and cart. More low, Hanzo. Bruh, Hanzo won. He just walked away from me. Oh, 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 oh. Just dealing car. More is one. More is actually one. Dying car, dying car. Like yeah. cat, change your kit. I am. Gonna feed. He was already feeding. Oh, I'm gonna feed. That sides. Do we do this, man? I can't bomb. Yup. Okay. Hello, Hazo. Nice. I come. Alright. Push in, push in, speeding! Nice, nice. And I'm Widow with you. I'm Dark Dragon. I put her in a special place. I'm on Widow. Mercy one. I'm on Mercy. Dead. Nice. Momoira. Reloading, 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 reloading. I'm on Widow. Oh, she's not there. Hans on no uh, the bridge. I have two Hans seven. on the bridge. He's one, he's one. No, Kuzo, why are you throwing? Alright. Why are we pushed up? I know, dude, stop. <laughs> I cry. I'm gonna get the most value out of where you are, Kuzo. <laughs> Alright, bull. I would have gotten more value if my team pushed up with my speed boost. But my speed boost got uh, no value. You man, more of more feeding on Mars. More than. More stuff. Back up to car, any heals? Fuck half. 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 Fuck more no fade, more no fade! More anti, there you go. I'm big speed. Watch hog. Hoggle, hoggle. Nice. Ursa low. Ursa dead. Stay up a reaper, stay up a reaper. Watch your reaper. 
Nah. We're dead. We're just one. Nice. Aww. I'm stuck in, bro. I'm sorry. Him in, him in, him in, him in. Come in, Zep. He's one, he's one. Oh my god. Keep out of my way. Stupid. I'm good. Nice. He took my Reaper kill away from me. I'm sorry, bro. You're so dog sick. Toxic teammate, Ben. Oh, let's get out play off the game because he pressed Q. Look at that. Nah. And he was playing Moira. He's just okay. a yeah. bro. DPS Moira, basically. Look at this skill. I got two of those kills, bro. 71 KP. <gasps> Look at this FT. They have both more to me. I'm giving it to the enemy widow. Toxic. <laughs> I was say he never missed a body shot on me, but I lost to Winston. So. Like, she kinda missed. Hard to. She missed. Sounds me. like me. She missed a fucking diva man. A body shot on a diva man. A body shot's a headshot on diva? No, it was turned back. She couldn't headshot. Uh. She missed my fucking body. That is true though, like everyone in Diva's front end. <laughs> they should give Sigma's toes a headshot hitbox. That would be nice. Look, I'm just speaking the truth here. You swapped his head his box to his toes. Yeah. I'm gonna go put lasagna in the oven. Sigma only has one skin when he's wearing shoes. Yeah, that'd be broken because then he wouldn't have a headshot hitbox. <laughs> I'm watching Tim's stream. Like Vlad, like a Vlad from Twitch, uh, from Tim's stream, and this is his face camera. Right Looking at him. Fucking losing his shit right now. He came back to this trash game. No. He's playing COD. Oh, even a trash your game. Yeah, when you lose Overwatch for COD. <laughs> I don't even need my to wait for that game. Old shiny head. Defenses. Select your hero. Should we run Bash in here? No. Should run die for this game. I'm going. I should run Doomfist and use the rollout. I use drawing ball. Wait, rollout? What? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Blizzard for all the rollout. Oh, yeah. Uh, no, we just, since it's done. Dude, I'll, I'll record just in case you hit it. Yo, no, I'm sort of upset because um, we're on Eichenwald and I should have went Doom and used Time that one. Wait, guys, you should only go that tier in this. No Moira, no Moira. Okay. Inefficient resources. Never stop fighting for what you believe in. I'm stuck in a ball, what the? Attackers incoming in 30 seconds. Pretty much just feeding. I'll get us home safe. How come I've never seen a Alright, if you land it, make sure to hit F9. Right. Yep. I gotta hide, like, right. right here. Pretty sure I remember how to do it. Just jump off and press E. What the <laughs> fuck, bro? <laughs> I can hide right up there. No, no. Oh, that doesn't work. I'll hide, like, Yeah, yeah. Look on ball, tell, 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 tell Sharp when there's people to the right of the statue. Yeah, I just sitting on the fucking... Or when okay. they're about to be there. Ruby, it is okay, just jump off. You fucking CC right? to the... Yeah. I no. love playing this hero. What? There's people now. There's people oh, now on the right. No! You <laughs> fucked up so bad. F9 dude, F9! F9! F9 dude, F9! <laughs> <laughs> I pressed E and it didn't work! Breathe! Enough feed. I love this game. The weird is killing everyone. Shh, 
my my my. Excellent job, Sharp. <laughs> A plus. It worked before. A plus, Sharp. I I didn't... Biggest play of my life. Okay, well, what is that kit? That's that fishing kit. I'm just gonna play this kit then. It's a good kit. Inefficient. You mean inefficient? There we go, let's go, boys. This is the meta, boys, let's go. Oh, whoa. Choose him. Okay. What? Play, let's play deathmatch. Really? That's one. Sharp, have you ever considered losing your resources properly? Who just left? Who no. just left? Seconds. Where is she? Where is she? Oh, no, okay, no, no, no. fine, look. Guys, I have full damage or all star. Okay. Let me up, let me up, let me up. I wanna. Meow. What the fuck was that, too? I need healing. I don't know how to play this game properly. Go to the bottom. Bottom. Get back in the fight. I'm gonna flank, let's go. She slid! What is that, dude? Part another one. Yeah, Get I'm gonna chop on that one. She just slid right off the wall. Oh, okay. uh, I'll reach one point, I'll reach one point. Sure, it's a point. I'm so upset. Sharp, have you ever considered using high ground? I got two picks. How does that make you guys feel? No. You're bad. Did it hit sure. you? Do you get it, though? Listen, it was a good use of resources. Is it a pick if you use your ult? It was a good pick of use of resources. Hey guys, do you want to Nazi 9 in here? Uh, Nazi no. Nazi 9 is a way of life. It's, it's good practice, it's good practice. <laughs> it's a way of life. Yeah, efficient use of our space on the payload. Oh, we're on top. Yeah. Hey, look at that. We're on turret? Oh, what, what is that thing called? What a one. Sharp, stop jumping, it gets hit scans. I... I it's a habit. That I need to Make stop. Make it not one. <laughs> Oh, no. Don't punch him to war! <laughs> I can't tell you. I can't tell you guys. I'm scared. Oh my god! Hey, I knew I'd kill that Zen eventually. Sigma's one, Sigma's one. Sigma, low resources. Uh, within a me, within a me, within a me, within a me. Within. My aim, breathe. <laughs> okay. Why just play deathmatch? Bro, I can't breathe. Guys, swap to a different kit. <laughs> no, guys, I don't think this kit's quite efficient. Okay, careful, though. careful! Watch the slender, big booty sniper rifle kit. You're not thinking main. about your position. <laughs> First, neither <laughs> I'm not either. <laughs> guys, insulting other people. Insulting. Are they use one of my abilities to take space. <laughs> okay, push it with abilities. I'm pushing the sigma. Sigma is one. I'm using my ability. Uh, messed up his jump. <laughs> sigma no shift. He's pretty upset. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, what a top left. What is that top? What is that top? What I got fucked. Nice. nice. Can you hold me? It's actually the slim, yeah, cover the slim my big booty hero please? with the kit got fucked. <laughs> <laughs> How are you winning this? I don't know. We have more fishing resources. We have better resources. They're going high ground. McRae and someone. Not true. We can confirm. Faded the resources. I have none. <laughs> <laughs> That definitely is very informative on which resources <laughs> you baited. Your resource bottom left, that thing was used? This is semantic. <laughs> resources bottom left. No. I'm feeding. <laughs> I got him again. <laughs> <laughs> sure. Dude, I said that. Give me your resources. I fat fingered, bro. Do you might eat resources? I need resources. Re what is this turning into? They're both healing on the- Anna's low on resources. I'm in- oh, I'm dead. Cause that's a little bit more informative, yeah. Yeah. Die with resources? Bro. <laughs> oh. Die with resources. <laughs> Die or with resources. Actual uh, children. <laughs> Did I end in the resource of time? Keep stalling. I'm hog. We're just not even trying this. <laughs> <laughs> it's like when we started the, shot calling. What you guys are trying to do is piss me off. On Junkenstein, <laughs> on Junkenstein, we were calling out the bots, dude. Oh, uh, soldier left side. So I slept them. Okay. Are you okay with resources right side? 
Speaking my low one, we're going to Come on, come on, come on. 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 Come Sharp, it has either been you do literally nothing in the fight but take damage, or you harden and you <laughs> die. There has been no in between. Don't get them anymore, all charge resource. Yeah, we should reset our resources in spawn. I'm just gonna take spawn. Use all resources in spawn. I have, I have, uh, I have a big resource. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> bro, my eyes. <laughs> How big, bro? I'll engage from the back of my resources. Engaging with my E? I got locked. Guys, use resources. No, no. Sharp, what the fuck? Sharp, that was the worst ult I've seen in a long time. I did that just to make you mad, too. I really hope so. I'm gonna switch my kit to get better efficiency out of my resources. Oh my god, Yokozo, he juked you so hard. Oh, he's playing on No, no, I juked him. I baited out his resources? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I baited resources out his have been spot. baited. By making him jump down, I had to push him into our team. Should play. take a high ground someday. Nah. Whenever. I'm gonna use my resources to make them less resources. Epping E, Epping E? Take Mr. Wong. Push in their lot of resources. Three <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> shoot her. <laughs> Uh, they're all the law and resources in the back. Primo, that that hurt almost as much as what Sharp did. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I was I wasn't like this whole match is just to make Ruby mad. <laughs> let's play table. Let's go. This is guys waste your resources. Don't have resources. Don't have resources. Tent buffing tenting. Okay, that call out is supposed to mean do something with them, not just chuck them at the point. <laughs> I saw the cat just walk on the point, sleep nothing, and just throw the nade at the ground. <laughs> well, he didn't like, have with them, it's fine. Wait, sleep? I didn't, I didn't you sleep? I, it looks like I sleep there, I don't know. Alright guys, I think that match went pretty well. Uh, yeah, yeah, it went pretty well. <laughs> oh shit. Primo, what the fuck was that? Don't worry, dude. It was, so he was using his resources. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got this soul, you're just sitting. No, I needed to make my resources touch their resources. That was a very mm. efficient use of his Q resource. <laughs> <laughs> he was denying those in Yada. <laughs> I mean, I sorry. I, he was denying their Discord touching. orb on another resource oh hero. God. Ruby just wants to kick oh all of us. Wait, do we have a scrim at 10? Yeah. yeah I, I'm gonna Amazon 14 little plastic chairs and put all of them in my corner and label them all for each of you. <laughs> This is your it's a fucking timeout chair. Do you have one? <laughs> right here, Zyda, if you get back in here, you're gonna play first. Like, I mean, we held in on second point for some reason. I don't know how it works. Yeah, so, um, so that, you, you say, oh, that was intentional, but you do that in scrims almost every ult. I'm promoting someone to group leader because my stomach needs resources. Okay, yeah, but not around, like, a corner. <laughs> No, you've done it like that before. I've seen alts like legitimately just like that. Like last scrim. That's one of the things you keep forgetting. Same with the May walls and Ice Block. Yeah. Even though we went over that, you forgot about it. I need to Remember. take a look at my resource paper. Now you need to watch, like, good Doomfist players and see what they're doing and Let think about why they're doing it. Chipset. I don't watch Chips. <laughs> I, I can't. I can't say he's not good, but I can definitely say he is not a good person to watch to learn the hero. He doesn't explain anything at all either. But like something that you are are never doing is use it like tap punching to chase down kills like someone will be far away from you and you'll just turn around and walk away when you could tap punch at them and uppercut and kill them like you could be getting picks but instead you're just turning around and running away it turns a lot better to me 
but that's like that's that's what I mean by like mechanics are more than just aim. Is that that's that is mechanics. He's not he's not doing things like that. Like you know, maybe like Sharp actually wants to. He's just not mechanically like skilled enough to pull that off. You just thought his brain is way too. Yeah, small. it's usually that I want to chase that person, but you just I'm don't like... know how to do it. But I'm like, I'm probably gonna mess this up somehow. Well, the only, especially do that stuff in quick play, because the only way you're gonna learn how to do it is by keep doing it. Yeah. Like when I played Doomfist, like th there was a solid like five hours of gameplay where I just sucked at landing any of my abilities. But I took all of those chances and stuff like that in quick play so that I could learn how how to do those those combos. Especially like the wait, what? My alt meter stuck on my screen. I died while popping my ult, and my ult meter was stuck on my screen. Interesting bug. Are we not playing another one? We have uh, uh, eight minutes, so... We're recharging our resources in the eight minutes before we start this go. <sighs> my... Alright, guys, FFA. <laughs> yeah, let's go FFA. Try, try going for that, uh, Sharp. When, when you see a person who's out of your range, right, you have all your, your abilities, try the, the tap punch type of cut. Especially if it's like a soldier or something like that. It's, it's okay. rare if a soldier to live so, that. Even if it's probably a feed. Even if it's probably a feed. Doing it in the first place is... Yeah. Yeah, you should at so least know what to do it so that you can learn when you're supposed to do it. But it's kind of to teach you when you're supposed to do it if you never land it. Or try it in the first place. Most not that's that's what all you guys should be doing. You guys should be going for those big plays, right? That take a that really rely on your mechanics, because it's the only way you're ever gonna improve them is by trying trying but to go for the shots. Aim is bad. Then make it not bad. The only thing I can do is track. Then learn how to do other things than track, and that's no, not I... even that's not in, that's aim. I'm, I'm talking about like mechanics. Where did Kuzo go? He went to recharge his resources, i.e. get my, food. My, my brain told me aim is everything. Yeah, well, <laughs> I'm telling you aim isn't everything. Right. You'll never it's land the rocks on Fars if you never take them. I mean, I do try that every time. Every time. Yeah, yeah, but that's at the, that's at the pull, though. It's different. Let me just see. No, like, I try every time, like, that I can do without, like, wasting it. So, start of fight, see if they're close enough, I throw Well, like, I, jumping in front of your teammates with, uh, like, Kinetic Grasp, right? Your shift to save them. How do you I know, get, how do you know if it'll work, if you've never tried it? That I will do as well, but not too often, because shift is unreliable. I do, like, if, if my shield is down, and the only thing I can do is shift, I gonna shift. Well, your goal is to be able to tell whether it will work, no. or... Whether or not before you do it. So the way it works is just fucking enter the, your friend's body and just become one with them. No, it, it, it only works in one direction. So yeah, own direction. That's not. It's not gonna work very well if you're doing like that. <laughs> no. We have to be sitting in my fucking bunker corner. Ah! Die, you demon! If, if anyone's a demon, it's you, Loco. <laughs> You're playing Arisa in FFA. Ah. <laughs> Whoa, please. There we go, I got a good corner. Much better. Yeah, Sai, what was that, dude? He that, slept me in got, the air, you, I don't know what you want. You got fucked. Just don't get slept. Is someone gonna come here? I'm just waiting. Did you fuck off? I'm not even playing for No one's coming here, I'm sad. Okay. No. No. I'm gonna reposition re. Where did you slice? <laughs> are you? Oh. But what? Okay, so we're gonna do the next. The next session we're doing is gonna be tomorrow. Uh, from but from the same time, I think. Wait, we're doing another session tomorrow. Hey, yeah. any uh, reason you're all focusing me? I no. got it. 
We should probably all focus Loka. I'm dying. Lake Cat, stop. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to kill Loco here. <laughs> I've come back from work. You guys leave me alone? Right, Dev, I really want to punch you out of the air. Well, you're not gonna. <laughs> the fucking man. No oh, shit. Stop. <laughs> okay, how am I gonna do this? Stop I it, Loco. Both, I'm trying I to both, do something. Both, I poke you. <laughs> Look, uh, I'm trying to, sharp, I'm trying sharp, to you, you know how to do it. You know how to do it, right? You punch against a, a, an object with a curved ledge and you hit space before you reach there. You know how to do it. I taught you. What? Hmm. Oh, he's playing how to, how to right now. Punch far out of the sky. Yeah, it's called AC. I'm dying. No, not even with your ult. You don't need your ult. Remember that remember that Dorado? That Dorado rolled out in first point? Uh yeah. Not just with that pillar, you can do that with other stuff. Just with random geometries. Like My kill. fucking chairs. Yeah, but Sidev's playing pretty low. <laughs> Got him, so worth playing, it. I playing, punched him, but he didn't hit a wall. <laughs> you're playing a junk rat, basically is what you're saying. Leave me alone, Farah. I'm back, I'm back. Okay, it's AC-130 time. Bruh. Never mind, it didn't work. Nice. Cause it didn't want to land on the roof. Let's go baby diva time. No. Dang it. Yes. Ah! Bonk! Oh my god, that god. scared me. Oh, I'm dead. Nice. I'm at the top of the leaderboard, so it doesn't matter. Bonk. Look, go away. No. Ah. Free kill. Alright, my mission is still to kill. Bruh. Shield bash hitbox. Hello. Ah. Ina, please. Gee, dang it. <laughs> no. I'm poking you. I'm poking you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm poking you. And I got here. Why did you poke me? Uh, Why are you poking me? Stop poking me. <laughs> Fuck you. <Nah>. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> I'm good. My about to go. Look, can't go away. He hasn't added me yet. Cancel scrim. Yeah, dude, I'd be pretty mad. No, side of. Yes, side of. Nope. Go away. No! I guess I'm to go away. Go away. Go away. Uh, yes. I secured my kill. Aw, oh, great. No Ina's on break. Looks like Tracer fun time is over. <laughs> okay, let's go into him. It's okay. He's back. Wait. <laughs> Wait a sec. I'm gonna go soldier. Wait, I'm gonna go soldier 76. Please Wait, what? That stuck. That stuck you. Nah. See my character. It stuck his shield, maybe. That wasn't the plan. Oh. Ever get that feeling of deja vu? Wait. That was a perfect impression. Why are you here? Get away, let's get. Get away. Yeet. Yeet. Yeah. Got him. <laughs> nice, bro. Ready for more. Why are you waiting oh, for God. the health? Run into me. 
They fucking bring. Oh. Oh wow, you debated me. Oh, get you beat it, bro. I'm scared. Uh, E, hello? And Does the E work? button work? Wait, wasn't there a thing in PTR where it took like three tracer clips to kill a McCree? This is going monkey. Not, no, not even to kill the McCree. It took three tracer clips to get the armor off the McCree. Yeah, the yeah. McCree. The fucking armor. The fourth clip killed him. This might need a few adjustments. Stupid immortality field, dude. I can't say. <laughs> Neither can I. Don't worry. <laughs> it's aiming. <laughs> oh, nice. Yeah, yeah, bull. I wouldn't expect you to understand your main tank. Zach, huh? oh, bro. Why do you go, monkey? That's my character. I mean, my cat. That's my cat. <laughs> yeah, that was a well-timed blink. You're mine, boy. You're mine. Uh, oh, e button. He's going Genshi against two monkeys. This is not the end of the world. Bonk. He's going Genshi against two monkeys. Yes. Well, there was one monkey Bonk. when I went Genshi, but I guess not anymore. Bonk. No. Good luck, guys. Be prepared. Hey, oh, no. Play. Oh, Wait, no. 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 Playing Widow. Why is Widow? Time. Wait, what is a Widow? Punk. <laughs> Yo, why is there so many monkeys, dude? Well, you cannot defeat me. I had the tree. Go away. Uh, who's? Oh, dude, I know. What cat? Oh my God, wins, sorry. Bro. Easy win, bro. How did that hit Check you? PM. Check PM. That's my kill, thank you. Well, it hasn't even started yet, so. Here's a hog. Oh, oh. <laughs> You're gonna kill side death with no. Nah, nah, you weren't. You saw it. Think you were going to, but in reality, you were not. In reality, you're just bad. Basically. Hey, let's not get toxic. With every death, I mean, it's true, we it's are fun. all bad. With honor, redemption. You went to Broadhog. And you monkey. <laughs> my hero. That's my hero. I off aimed you. Why are you still monkey? What a nerd. There's a hog on me. Lit cat. Hey, there's a widow. Get off of me. <laughs> ah. That should have hit you. The hog is hunting me down. Yeah, he's actually just hunting me. I'm just going where the people are. Oh my god, place I get one kill. I have no ammo. I have no ammo. No. Epic. Epic. Ruby, hey, come and judge, judge me on my aim. Spoilers, uh, I'm trying really to bad. get this fucking scrim to happen. True. I'm here. You are dead. Loco, sigh. Stop being nubs. I don't you landed on my head. Yeah, I landed on your head. Jump. No, oh, I missed. Also... This is the end. <laughs> Jump again. Enemy needs 15 kills to win. What the fuck? Hey, I got a headshot. About time. It's on the Roadhog. It didn't even matter. Oh, that was so close to hitting you. This guy in general chats pissing and moaning about Smurfs throwing his games, but he doesn't report them. Wait, we give general shit of what? No holy cat. Yeah. <laughs> How did the Where are you? <laughs> okay, dude. 
I missed twice on a Roadhog. That was yes. open. I'm gonna kill a local user. I'm inviting Primo. I'm gonna go Widow now, let's go. Oh, we should all go Widow. Okay, well, I'm gonna switch off this trash here and then Widow Waker. Yo, Luca, <laughs> 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 Bruh, that was my kill! This is bullshit. Primo, you ass. I'm bad. Oh my god, of course he does a roll. Indeed. I can't aim. Oh, you stole my kill. I gotta send you. God, I'm dead. No, Wade is not my character. <laughs> Only through conflict. Ah. Bro. You e flew. E takes too <laughs> long, bro. Nah, it's fine. Enemy needs 10 kills to win. Nope. Worth. Look, cat, why couldn't you do that earlier? No! That was my. Damn, he didn't even fucking hit. He booed me off the map and stole my kill in one fell move. Ah, oh, there we go. Oh, come back. I'm gonna do that. Nina, don't. So I can murder you. Back in the saddle again. Come back. Oh, hello. You came I back, thank I you. I pressed E, but it didn't work. Sorry, Primo. So no scrim? Or... What? What the fuck? You I don't know. The, the, guy can't, the guy hasn't answered me. And he left the server, so DM, uh, so Discord won't let me DM him. Because we don't share any servers. Cancel. Where'd you go? Oh my god, Ian, I hate you. Stealing my kills and killing me. Get over here! <laughs> Main heaven. Oh, I was gonna melee you. I'll play. No, we've got. Never. I'll play. Oh, Primo. Oh, wait, no, that was Kuzo. I feel like a new man. <laughs> what Look the fuck was that? I blinked. Oh, it's a broken hero. Just what the doctor ordered. Every hero is broken. There are no heroes, so there's nothing broken. True, you're right. Oh, Everyone's just researching. No, no kids are just more efficient than others. Bro, this fucking post! I would've hooked you! There you wow. Are. I blanked on the way. Although blanks didn't seem to work. I have no ammo. Oh my god, Sharp stealing my kills. I have no ammo. Nah, dude, you were about to steal mine. Get out. Oh, where was that? Hi. Oh, you're one, the cat. Ah! You just whipped me. No. What the fuck? The guy deleted his Discord account. bro. Wait, what? The guy deleted his Discord account. Hey, I'll go in front. That's pretty yeah. funny, bro. That cancels for a script. I know the character to win. Yo, I think he did. But I think that's a cancel. I think he did. Because it's saying I don't have... We no. don't have any servers. Where are kills? It, it's saying we don't share any oh, servers, so I can't DM him. And when I hit add... Ah. Friend, it says it didn't work. Check the capitalization, which I think means that like he deleted his account because we're still on servers. No, it's bullshit. Yeah, that's what I like. have less deaths, so I win. This guy is on the minute. servers, like. I meant the lick cat. No, I'm saying this. Oh, am I playing the game? If you go another one, I'm gonna go bash. Another one. Another one. You got it, bro. We the best music. Welcome to Castile. I know.
My business, my rules. Epic um, meme, yeah, Uzo. I see your meme. Hero. Select your hero. Epic meme, bro. What? Epic meme, Kuzo. I saw your Thank meme. You. In to widow Thank you. Me. Widow. All right, let's do widows only. Okay. Does that work? That widow. I'll put you there. Wait, no, that's not Widowmaker. All right, hold on. I'll go Winston. Uh, stop! Don't do it. Don't force me to do it. Please don't force me to do it. Stop it. Do it. It's like headshot only, and I'm like not gonna have fun because I can't. Not headshots only. No, I'll I'll just I'll just do it. Everything is normal, except it's only with it. Oh my god! This is headshot only. Are you gonna start it? There we go. Yeah, dude. Be headshot only, please. It's not headshot. Oh fucking! I feel fags. Isn't that better? Um, Dude, you, can, what the you can body shot people in Widow duels. You know that, right? <laughs> in game, you you can in fact body shot people. Fucking SMG twos. Oh SMG, let's go. Yeah, but that's disrespectful though. That's like flashbang right clicking another McCree. Exactly. You don't do that. What is that? You, you, don't, do that. you don't flashbang right click another McCree, dude. <laughs> it's just bad manners. I have the SMG sound permanently playing, and I don't know what to do about it. Just shoot, and then it'll be good. It's like you don't solo okay, hog another it. hog into a corner. You just don't do that. No, you do do that. That's just rude. Where are you? Oof. Nice job. You, the only time where you do do that is you is you you pulse another tracer out of recall. That's that's the only time. I just started that. Wait, so what, what happened? Are we not streaming? I guess, uh, I guess not, because the guy deleted his Discord. <laughs> Can we get one, though? Uh, I mean... Okay, I might have made a mistake right. leaving on us. And after 10? Uh, I don't know. Yeah, like, quarter after 10 is gonna be, like, really hard. Yeah, because my message is the newest message in most of the servers. Bruh. Bruh. Do, do you want to fight a 2k team? No. <laughs> Dude. Do we have to switch roles? Sounds real fun for everyone. Yeah, uh, my I message is the newest right. message in all the that? servers. Primo, please. Primo, please! I'm getting no! fucked in the ass! No! Yeah, I definitely made a mistake leaving SMG on. Why do I feel like Bulls just SMGing the whole time? No, I'm not actually. I'm the empty one that does SMG all the time. He's not fully charging his shots and then he I mean, I'm not even hitting people in the first place, so... No, Kuzo. Actually, hard. Oh, no way, Shard. <laughs> Bro, I didn't know where you went. Arrow! Why don't you die? Yes, I got it! Oh, this is bullshit! <laughs> yeah, that's what you get. Oof. Oh, I had such Eat a fuck off! <laughs> oh, you're actually doing well. Oh my god, you are not. Oh, he's body shotting. Right. I mean, you're headshotting at least. True. Headshotting like body shotting. I mean, he headshot me at least twice. I think I've had three total. Well, if we're not talking and about, <sighs> if we're not doing a scrim, then I can talk about mechanics. Yeah, we can do that actually. Yeah, at least start a little bit. Then I can actually aim now. Cool. Well, it'll take you a little bit, but uh, uh -huh. it, it, I, I would uh, advise against going back to your old aiming habits. Bro, just quit kids. Just click it. Heads, nerd. Bro, who's that? Loco. <laughs> For once in your life, can you not SMG? <laughs> I can't think. <laughs> I'm freaking bored. Okay, if the, if the main tanks beat you, you're kicked off DPS. Bro, I'm the lowest elo. I have an excuse. I'm trash. I'm playing on yeah, a but you're also monitor. a hit scan player. Yeah. <laughs> that is. I don't know where that rumor started, but I'm not. 
when you volunteered to play hitscan. Ah, fuck my pinky. Ah, shit. You know the, those ten scrims that you played hitscan for half the scrim in? <laughs> I mean, because you guys make me. <laughs> yeah, well, you do kind of have to choose a role, so. Yo, I'm pretty sure we get advertised for a... A uh, hitscan? Uh, like, no. I was definitely not advertised as a hitscan player. No, you were not advertised. We advertised for a hitscan player, and then you showed up to tryouts. Exactly. No, I showed up because I was asked, because Skippy asked me to. I didn't answer any ad. Skippy contacted me. Do you guys, like, know each other? Like, IRL? Or... No, he just messaged no, me out of the No, Sk Skippy watched uh, Happy Squids before they disbanded, or whatever. Uh, it's also in the Discord. Got all right. Thing. Who wants to go first for the Since I'm here, I guess. I'll go. Right, yo, why don't, why don't we stop that and we talk about mechanics? Okay. What do you mean? Mechanics, How about we do both? And then, we, and then we come back and then we see. No one cares, yeah. Ina. Bro, no one cares, either. I love the way they're FFA. Living in the past, bro. <laughs> just did like three Get over it, dude. Living in the past. <laughs> God, get over it, bro. This is such a fucking meme. so long ago. <laughs> Okay, wait, are we talking I thought, about- No, I thought yes. we were talking about- I want to talk about mechanics, or else I'm gonna mechanics. blow my brain out. Everyone, shut up, children. <laughs> <laughs> Is there a Google Doc to look at? No. This oh. one's gonna be off the top of my head, because that's how we're gonna do this tomorrow. Oh. Children just oh, don't worry, it's fine. I, I, this, is, this is not hard, so. Okay, so. We were talking about palm grip earlier, right? Uh-huh. How do you- how, do any of you guys use non claw? Uh, uh, I I think I use my palm. Yeah, I still don't really know the difference, but. Okay. I'm trying. Lift to your mouse up. Claw. Lift your mouse up. Flip it over so you're looking at the bottom. Is okay. anything touching your mouse other than your fingers, your fingertips? When oh you do that? yes. The same same way you're gripping. The same way you're gripping right now and like aiming. Lift your hand up, flip it over. It is anything other than your fingertips touching your mouse? Yes, the meat of my thumb, but that's it. Okay, that, that's still your your thumb for the most yeah, part. Yeah, I, I grip the bottom of the mouse with like my thumb and my pinky. Do, does it, it? Does any of you use your palm of your hand? Does that touch your mouse at any point? Mine does. Yes. Kind of, but it like rests on my mouse. Yeah. Okay. It's not you like want... actually grabbing my mouse. My, you my want palm... to stop doing that. My, my palm will brush my mouse, but it won't like actually like it's not usually touching it. So like everyone, you can go and practice range and do this. Like I, I sit in practice range a lot, so. Like I, 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 I play finger tip and then I swap to claw or claw palm whatever. Crab. Yeah, it's that fucking thing, <laughs> crab. So that abomination of a fucking. <laughs> So I want you guys to try aiming like this, right? So what, the the reason you do this is because you use your arm for um, like 180s, right? And flicking big distances. Use your wrist for target acquisition and the fingertips you're using for moving from the ma from the body to the head. Leave this to me. I and fucking yes, don't have space to do that. matters still on things like Sigma and Monkey. Yes, it still matters because you're not always going to be playing those heroes all the time. And you having two good mechanics will never be a problem. <laughs> Justice ain't gonna dispense. It. So when clawing is you your palm just not supposed aim. to touch no. your mouth at all? No, the, the, well the only time is when I move my mouse, like when I move my fingertips, I move my mouse really far back towards my hand, then it touches. But I don't like move it any further back than that. And when I move my mouse back up, my palm doesn't follow it. Because when you're trying to track a tracer on Zarya, you need your aim to be like fucking top notch, dude. And when you're flicking at that far to try and fire strike her, right? This will actually make a difference. Also, one thing, Ruby, you told me like that, and then I can fucking track you even better. Because like you, because no, I track smoothly with my old grip. 
With this one, I can do like those things that Tracer players does. Do not name exactly. Well, like, the the better your aim is, the less you have to focus on your mechanics, right? Like, the better your mechanics are, the less you have to focus on it, the more you can focus on the team fight as a whole. So even if you're not playing a character that requires, like, really good mechanics, the better your mechanics are, the less you have to, to focus on them in-game, right? Like, especially on main tank and, like, uh, main support, right? Or, like, Mercy isn't... she doesn't require good mechanics, right? Per se. But the better mechanics you have as a Mercy player, the more thought you can put into actually playing the hero itself, and not and not fucking up your jumps. You know, like when you you know when you're first learning how to do that Mercy jump, right, Kusa? Yeah. When, every time you do it, you have to really focus every time, like after you learn it. Mm -hmm. That's what you're trying. Like once your mechanics are good, are like good enough, you won't have to focus on that stuff anymore, and you'll be able to just do it, like subconsciously and so now you're focusing less on your mechanics and more on the actual game and you won't make near as many mistakes so it doesn't matter what what hero you're playing mechanics matters regardless mm -hmm. but so I think I've already gone over like a like settings and stuff like that with everyone where plan 75 to 50 if you can play on 50 and need to and like have a shitty computer then play on 50 but everything should be on absolute lowest. Oh, I don't think you went through my settings at all. Yeah, I don't think with you, but I know I know with um. You didn't go all. through with me either. Okay, well here we'll uh, go. Having a high but most of my stuff is on low. Yeah. Do you want to have everything on low? Something. The, the only things that I would say you would change off of low are maybe your um like your models. Like your texture quality, maybe. Yeah, it's basically oh. a model model detail. I put the put um, those like maybe medium if you really can't handle it. But the everyone only should be playing thing I on seventy five. Medium is texture quality. Yeah, you um you want to be playing on seventy five percent render scale or fifty. A hundred doesn't do anything. Oh okay. It, it so, will look like shit. It will look like shit for like three games, and after that you won't notice it. Trust me. So How do you feel about? All of my settings being on epic this whole time. How do you feel? Um, I wanna fucking punch you. <laughs> That's Yo, what like FPS really you play stupid. On, I I don't really tip below like twenty. Okay, well you wanna try to get as many, like as high FPS as humanly possible. Because even though your monitor might not be able to display it, like mine's only 144 hertz, but I set it to 225. All the FPS past that goes to reducing input lag. So why do you want? So why would you want a uh, render scale? Because it's just a flat, uh, like resource save on your system. It's like it's like turning the overall texture quality of your entire game down. It's like turning all of your settings to seventy five percent. So again, it's gonna look like shit for like two games, but after that, you won't really notice it that much. I changed mine to seventy. It's gonna suck, I know, you're not gonna like me for the next couple days. Okay. Yeah, but your I really performance don't like is gonna... you right now. <laughs> 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 yeah, I, I used to play on 100, but it doesn't it, it doesn't do anything. 50 can make it things a little hard. Um, like, a, if you're a Widow player, I probably wouldn't use 50. But like, people like Soon use 50, but Soon has some pretty outlandish settings. Um... What do you mean by outlandish? His scope sense on Widow is a hundred. A hundred Jesus. scope sense. What the fuck? Yeah. I don't know what that equates to. Um, it equates to like doing a 360 with one inch of your mouse movement. What? The guy's Just a fish spinner. sensitivity to <laughs> What's his, like, DPI? He, he uses this so that when tracers dive him, he can kill them really easily. Which is why he sucks in Widow duels, but is good against killing tracers. Wait, but in dive meta, the, the reason he has this is because of dive meta, so, like, there was never, like... Nobody wanted to run Riddle against him, right? Because they would destroy them on they, they would he would destroy them on Tracer and nobody wanted to run Widow against the guy who would destroy you on Tracer. <laughs> huh. 
But like that was back in the day. Now it's not very good, but he doesn't want to change because he's already gotten used to it. Understandable. For a player like that, anyway. I changed my sensitivity and like scope sense way too much than I should. I never change my sense, I just leave it. So well, got a two deep zone amount is fine. That stopped. Is is anyone's EDPI over like six or seven K? Mine's like seven and a half K. Yeah. Mine's almost seven. Also like I that's like a, that's like an okay spot. Yeah, it's what's well, because when I play monkey, like it's easier to jump up to high ground and be able to turn around in 360, like yeah. in one swoop of my mouse. Well, sense kind of depends on your play area too. If, if you don't have a really good, like if you don't have a big play area, then you can't really use low senses. I have a really big play area, so I can. I have low sense. I use 4800, which is like average. It's the same as sharps is, so. I have like 5000. Wait, do you have the same sense? What? I have the same mouse pad as you, and I think I have the same mouse too. What mouse do you have? Oh, uh, Logitech G300S. Pretty sure I have a different Alright, well, it looks similar. I, I showed them the, the picture Brutal sent of your setup when I yeah. told them to go check. We definitely have the same it. mouse pad. Yeah, I've got the Steel Series. But my mouse is a. Uh... Logitech G203. Oh, okay, so it's the same brand, it's slightly different. I mostly got it because of its size. And Logitech is just good at making money. Yeah, if you guys can lower it a little bit, it's probably a good idea, but. Um. But look, like, God. not like if you're past like like six k EDPI, it doesn't really matter at that point. Like, it's you're you're pretty close to average. Average is like 4,800 across like most players. Uh, should I end recording? Places that are like high ranked. What? <laughs> should I end recording now? <laughs> Have you been recording this oh whole God. time? Yeah. <laughs> um, not yet, not yet. Okay. Um, yeah. Never had so sense, sense is like one thing where it can be like player, like influence like it's it's kind of depends on your setup if you can use like low senses for, uh, for like I, Giguri, right where Giguri has like like 20k edpi yeah how um, does she play with that like, like she plays with that because she's been playing with it for like 10 years and she's always been playing with a really tiny mouse pad so she has to so like on one she has to on second she's been playing with it for like a fucking century a decade i should say Doing like the little micro adjustments from like the chest to the head with my fingertips actually helps a lot. Whoa, dude! It's almost like things I say are actually helpful. I mean, just a little bit, actually. Like I can hit shots slightly. Yeah, just don't be deceived by the bots. The bots have like an eight times bigger head headshot hitbox than Genji does. So every one in eight shots you just shot would hit a Genji in an actual game. And that was if the Genji was moving like that. <laughs> but the, uh... The practice range is actually pretty decent for, like, my initial, like, warm-up. Like, when I get on, I sit in practice range for a couple minutes. Just to, like, warm up my hands. Get a bit of aim practice in. I usually use characters like Tracer. You're not one of those people that goes into practice range, kills a few bots, and then immediately goes to comp. No, never do that. I've seen so. It, many it takes it takes at least an hour to warm up. So if you haven't played for an hour before the scrim, then you're going to be still warming up in the scrim. At least an hour. That one we always tell the first map. Yeah. Because you guys don't know what the word warm up means. Messing around and quickly. Like obviously you guys aren't owl, but for for no, owl teams, they usually take four to five hours of warming up before the actual game that they play. Yep. Yep. 
And so when people say play, like, just play a lot, right? Like, Loco's heard that like 700 million times from Osu. Um, but play a lot in Overwatch means a little bit different than other games. It's not, it's not just playing a lot, how, like, warms you up or anything like that. It's, it's that... Uh, when you're when you're warming up, right? And when you get on during the day, you're trying to spend the next like two hours getting your mechanics back to the spot where they were yesterday when you got off, right? And so you have to play for. You at least have to play until you're warmed up in order to actually improve your mechanics at all, right? That's why, like pro players and and like high ranks like hit scan players and stuff like that, right? That's why they play for like 12 hours a day because they spend that like first six hours just warming up to where they were yesterday and then they spend the next six hours improving their mechanics, right? Like adding on to the foundation that they had. So playing for only two hours, you'll n your mechanics will never really improve playing for two hours a day. No stopping me. It's it's more important in the long run to play for two hours every day instead of one hour or for two hours every other day than one hour every day because you'll be spending that one hour every single time no warming up. Required. You'll never actually be improving your mechanics. You're just spending the whole time warming up. It's not all. Also, try not to be those people like me, where I play for like 15 minutes and then get off for an hour and then play for another 15 minutes. <laughs> or like 30 minutes. Hey, I do that. Well, because again, right, you, you're not warming up very fast and the, the breaks you're taking in between are, are like in the process of cooling you down every time. So it's almost redundant. Almost. Um, some other things, like, just small things that you can do to, this, this won't make your, like, your aim better, or mechanics better or anything, but it'll definitely help you improve a little bit faster, is, um, you wanna really, your goal really is to have the only thing change in between play sessions is you, is, like, your mental, like, your mindset. You, you want to be sitting in the same position every time you play, like, you want to have your monitors in the same spot, you don't want anything to change. Like, this is how people do experiments, right? Where they... They have every other factor other than the one they're testing the same for every experiment. It's kind of the same thing, right? When you're improving, you want the only thing to change... You don't want to be get trying to get used to a new monitor setup every time you go to play Overwatch. You don't, you don't want to be getting used to a new posture and aiming with a new posture, right? And your hand's in a different position every single time you play Overwatch. That's the new, that's my scientific method. That's that common sense right there. You need it, killer. Hold up now. Yeah, I don't know if I can do that one because my monitor likes to magically move. Magically move. Hmm. <laughs> like, does the actual monitor itself move, or does it just like tilt and kind of shove the side to side? Like the monitor itself. Like, does the stand move? Is that what's moving? Yeah. Uh, take tape or like a bright marker or something like that, or or both rather, um, and like draw or tape around your monitor onto the desk so that you can move your monitor stand back to the same spot every time. If, like if 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 that's the thing that's like, if that's what's going on, right? And you you can't have your your stuff in the same spot. Like put put tape on the ground on the for the wheels of your chair, so that you you wheel your chair onto the same marks on the floor every time. Especially if it's if it's like masking tape and stuff like that. Like that, it's not gonna damage anything like your desk or something. Yeah, my chair uh, won't move considering it's on carpet. Yeah, mine's kind of the same thing. I have I have one of those uh, plastic pads, but I, my chair is in the same spot every time, so it just sunk into the plastic pad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, mine's I also have a uh, very too. big chair, so doesn't really like to move. So do you see the problem with playing Overwatch on a laptop now? 
Yeah. Um, laptops in general aren't very good. Well, and also every time you play, you're in a different position. Yeah. Which is why when you're not at your house, you should actually try to make an effort not to play Overwatch. What? When you, when you're not at your house and you're you're not on your own setup, you should try to make an effort not to play Overwatch because then you that you're spending an hour warming up to a completely different setup than yours, right? So then when you go back to your house and try to play in yours, you're like double like cold. Because mm. not only are you having to warm up to your to your mechanics again, right? You're having to warm up to a totally new setup again, again. <laughs> A game. Not playing Overwatch for a week and then getting back to it is awful. I play Lucio, so I can't relate. Uh, was that supposed Whatever. to be a meme about Lucio's boring to play? Yes. Okay. <laughs> Coming from the guy who likes to play Mercy. I love Lucio. I, 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 I like Lucio and Mercy. Night where I kept trying to play Brig. Anything else? That's the main thing for everyone. Yeah. Like, just try to make your uh, make your setup as consistent as possible. Did you say make what seventy five percent? Your render? Back. Your render scale, yeah. Yeah. Why, dude? I tried it. And I was just like, oh because it, it it will give you more frames. It'll give you more frames. Mhm. Mm it did. It gave me way more frames, bro. <laughs> Maybe I'll wait until my need. If GT. this doesn't give no, me that definitely that you should do it. You should at least do it now because your your settings are worse. Like your your setup is worse, so it'll help you more now. Okay. Yeah, Primo, stop be having a bad setup. I have a sixty hertz monitor. About one forty four. Oh, so yeah, if you don't have one forty four, you're kind of just GGs. Pivens. It's not, it's not that bad. One for you. It's, an, it's an uphill battle at that point. Wait, what are you? What do you have to tie? Uh, I think 60. Oof. I think I'm getting my next week. Maybe another one. Let me drop a big four. Well, this one's new, so I don't really want to place it. Why would you buy a new 60 hertz monitor? Because I need. I wanted a second monitor, and this is what I got. This is what was in my budget. There's a while where. But so. Why would you not use your? Why would you not buy 144 and then use your 60 hertz now as the second monitor? Well, no, I'm playing. I have. I don't know what the other one is that I was using before, but that's oh, my so second monitor. Oh, you had to replace it. It's not a. Se it's not a second monitor. It's like you're replacing your original one. Okay. I thought by second monitor you meant you using the both at the same time. No, no, no. I am. But I got this. The 60 hertz, that's what I play on, and then my old monitor is what I use as my second one. So wait, what's the old one? I don't know. Maybe 60 hertz? I don't know. It's not that good. <laughs> you downgrade. Yeah, I, ju I just don't know why you'd buy a monitor nowadays. doesn't have the money uh, for it. They're practically the same um, like amount of money now. What is it? Like, 60 and 44? Yeah. And 144? What? No? Hello? Yeah, the 60 is like 200 bucks, and then 144 is 100 or 350. It's a hundred, like the same price. Lol, 150 bucks difference. Same price. Yeah, but why would you spend 200 dollars when you could like either wait or just spend a little bit more and get a monitor that's worth using? Oh Especially since you're probably gonna have to buy a new other one now. <laughs> Bro, just upgrade to like Brutal's level. Monitor and then you'll be masters. Well, it's just like now you kind of have to buy a third monitor. I'll probably buy another monitor when I inevitably build a new PC. There was a while where uh, I was still playing on 60, even though I had a. I mean, Greek did that for like three years or whatever, like two years. He had a 144 hertz monitor and had it set to 60 for the whole two years he bought it. I think I did it like the first three days because I like it didn't do it on. Uh, 
I'm definitely on 140 before now because I can tell the difference. When it's on my laptop. Yeah, my FPS went from like 60 to 150. I my, on the game, mine still just says 144 constantly, oh God, even though I uncapped it. So I don't really know. I'm not enjoying this. What? 75 render scale. I told you you weren't gonna like me. What's why not? Love a check, actually. It looks kind of weird, but like I don't know. It's not that I bad. I can deal with it. It's fine. I can deal. I can deal with it. It just makes me feel like I'm not wearing my glasses anymore, and that like yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I got the yeah, same. Exactly. Vibe. It's kind of foggy. Now put it to fifty. Now put it to fifty. Oh, well, I, used to, I used to play it on a laptop, so like I know what it looks like. Like I don't, really, so... I don't really care. But when I first started playing the game on PC, by the way, I made it the smallest possible window you could on the lowest resolution and at fifty render scale. So I had it in windowed mode on the smallest window on the lowest resolution. And with 50% render scale, and I was getting 50 FPS. So mine's on automatic, so it's at 141%. Yeah, don't. That's like the worst part. That's like fucking suicide right there. Like that's that's performance suicide putting it to automatic. Okay, well now it's on 75. What the fuck is this game? <laughs> 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 this, this is bullshit trash! <laughs> this looks worse than fucking half a line. This is a requirement, by the way. Have, you have to do this. Put it on 75. You have to put it on 75. At least 75. I definitely get more frames. I'm keeping well, it on 100, obviously. but I'm saying yeah. 75. Especially if you're on automatic, dude. Oh, of course you're gonna get more frames. I can I can tell the difference. Like automatic the, is like the word. Better. Okay, so, so the reason why that setting is there and why it goes past a uh, hundred is so that say you like the um, the HUD proportions of 1080p, right? We have a 1440p monitor, right? Where all of the HUD is normally smaller. You can put it to 1080p, the resolution, and then set the render scale to 150, and it will boost the resolution up to. That generally that oh. setting. I mean, I'm so just, now I you now you have the, the the look and feel of a 1080p, but with the higher pixel density. So if you only have a 1080p monitor, that whole time, every time it goes above 100, it's just instantly just drowning your drowning your CPU in like processes it doesn't need to do because you don't even have a monitor that can look at. It's literally rendering pixels your monitor can't display. <laughs> All right, let's make it even better. Let me just take off my glasses. <laughs> Put it on 50 and then take off your glasses. Bro, when I have my glasses on, it's like 4K. When I take them off, it's like 144. Oh, dude, I remember this. Dude, I didn't even notice it changed for a second. It changed from 50. I didn't even notice. So now when you go in game, Try to keep looking at your FPS and see about where it hovers while you're in mid team fight. I mean, mine and always wanna, says 144. What? I always says 144. Oh, then it, you're you're capped in your GeForce drivers, like your. Uh, uh, yeah. I'll see if I can fix that. Uh, yeah. So an Nvidia control panel. Assuming an, assuming you have an Nvidia card. Yeah. Wait, so you should cap? Yeah, you should. So what you're trying to do is, now that you have FPS that's usable, you're trying to cap it in a place to reduce the, the difference between your highest FPS and your lowest FPS. Like like, like the same thing with, with uh, your posture and shit like that, you're trying to reduce the number of things that change while you're playing. So you want to you wanna get your FPS as consistent as possible. I've capped mine at 225, and I'd never dip anywhere below 225 ever. Except for, like, maybe if, like, literally every single person on the map's hitting ults. <laughs> then it drops to, like, 210. But at that point, I'm so focused, I'll never notice it. How high over 144 should I have it? Uh, we well, should just have it uncapped. Okay. In game, but, like, on my drivers. Oh Does yeah, on, on on your that? drivers uncapped or like okay. yeah. in your first experience it should be uncapped. It's probably a setting um, for VSync is probably what it is. Oh yeah. My FPS is going between like one fifty and one fifty. 
Oh, is this in practice range or is this in game? It's in practice range. Practice range is really skewed. The map is a lot smaller than all the other maps and there's a lot less to process. So don't yeah. go off of the FPS it shows you in practice range. We'll have to check out in game. Yeah. Like even not like Chateau Guillard. Like even those maps are still skewed because they're so much smaller. Oh, it's up to my drivers. I haven't done that in a while. Where? What's the thing? Yeah. Um, so are you in your, are you in your NVIDIA control panel? Yeah. So go to manage 3D settings. And there should be somewhere here. Vertical sync. At the bottom. And then you put use uh, 3D application setting. No payment required. This one's on the house. Uh, I just got a lever in my comp game and I'm officially gold. A primo. <laughs> he said A. <laughs> a bro. Imagine being fucking Wait, gold. Wait, no, I'm plat. Fucking trash. Shut up, Ina. I'm plat. Not you, primo. I yeah, Primo, you, you fucking suck, dude. And I'm masters in PTRE. Who cares about fucking PTR? You PTR was pretty scuffed, dude. Yeah. I, I was watching a video, it was like, oh yeah, what's my qualifications? He goes, yeah, I was number one on PTR, and I'm just like... Lord <laughs> 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 I was in PTR. I stole that from Dread like that. I was 3700, I'm on the same level, it's brutal. Uh, Y'all are fucking top 500 masters, cause no actual fucking top 500s or masters bothered to rank on just BTR. Or play anyway. So I don't even think I have the NVIDIA control panel downloaded, so... How, that, that's not how an NVIDIA control panel works. So... It is your driver software. It is your drivers. Yeah. You can't just not have your drivers. Okay, well. Uh, right click the desktop. Go to desktop, right click desktop, and NVIDIA control panel should be an option there. Oh, I'm just done then. <laughs> I type it in the search bar and then it didn't come up. I'm like, what the fuck? Like, it's not a regular program. It's your drivers. You can't just uninstall the NVIDIA control panel. You can uninstall GeForce Experience. Which you definitely should do. It's a shitty program. But. Wait, so, it? manage 3D settings, and then all the way at the bottom. Vertical sync. Why is that too? Uh, use 3D application setting. I've already on that. Oh, try off. Ruby. And then hit apply. Yeah? You think I should get a shadow key? No. No. No, it kind of sucks to be honest. I I don't play it anymore. I stopped playing it weeks ago. It's just it's not, you know, taking the 500 million a year cut from Activision kind of hurt. Guess I got all the restart my game. Oh my god, Kuzo, I love that meme, by the way. Dude. Thank you. <laughs> mine, 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 <laughs> mine, 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 mine. Uh, resource, resource, resource. <laughs> hours, 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 hours. <laughs> um, should I end the recording then? Oh uh, yeah, you're good, I think. Do okay, it. Okay.